Howdy! How do you do? Hi, everybody! Welcome! Good evening! All my little piggies, my little piglets. Hey! I realize I never told anybody I wasn't streaming Sunday, so a lot of people probably came in here and were wondering. Dude, I'm not putting up the lights one week before Christmas. It's too late now. You missed out on your opportunity. It's your fault. <laughs> you didn't remind me in time. That's on you. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Give us pogging Santa. Oh, wait a minute. Happy holidays. This is all you're getting. This is all you're getting. All right. Hold on. Can you go here? There we go. Old Saint Nick. <laughs> but now I gotta put the kid. I gotta put the mic in a weird spot so you can see him. This isn't normal. Hi everybody. Happy Happy Come Tuesday. This is Old Saint Nick gaming and pogging. He's gaming outrageously. Hi, everybody. Hello, Claimers. Hey, hey, enjoy the free sub. Congratulations. So proud of you for turning it in. Got my hat. Dude, I, a lot of people have added me saying that they got their merch. I'm very happy with it. Looks like everybody got it on time. It's nice. You going to talk about the summit. What, the, the scuff tour? I'll talk about it briefly, I guess. I wore your merch this weekend and everybody complimented my fit. Dude, I legitimately, like, so when it came to that, I, I've never put out merch before, right? And I did that because I don't want to have YouTuber merch or Twitch merch, which is just, like, me and my pet, right? Or, like, me, like, I, I don't know, a cartoon version of me looking determined. I just think it, I, it's not for me. So I wanted to do cool stuff. And so I did th stuff that I thought was cool. I hit up Steelix, and he made great stuff. Has anyone DM'd you about the Toyota pickup? No. <laughs> it's not there. It's not going to be there. That was like 15 years ago. All right, that guy just left. Everybody, go find it right now. Everybody, just go to Connecticut right now. That guy's not looking anymore. What happened to that monkey statue my, your dad gave you? It's right here. Right over here to my side. It's chilling. Tell me if this idea is pog or dog. A melee smash ultimate. I don't care. Melee. <laughs> Why are you coming to me with a melee idea? They don't need more attention. <laughs> they already got enough attention. Look at this. Hold on. Bro, look at this. No! We lost! We're down 70k? No! What happened? We have the new game! Bill was supposed to look at our game! <laughs> it looks like I watched all 10 hours of Melee and like 30 minutes of Ultimate. Yeah, Leo wins. Woohoo. <laughs> and I just leave. <laughs> Whatever. Leo wins again. Thank you, Tyrant. Uh, it was a fun event. Listen to how this VOD starts, by the way. It starts off with Charles oo-wooing. <laughs> Why did he do that? He oo-woos at the start of the VOD. <laughs> Hbox looked exhausted yesterday. Dude, when I, ta I talked with him briefly at this event, bro had bags on bags under his eyes. Hbox looked sick. I don't know what was going on, dude. He, like, like he, he sometimes has dark circles because the man never sleeps. He's content all day, every day, but... 
Will React Wars be delayed to Tuesday because of Christmas? Yes! React Wars is on Tuesday of next week. So be ready for that. I was going to do it tonight, but I was like, eh. Thanks, Tax. It's not my birthday, but thank you. Yeah, fun event. Um, uh, it was fun to cast. I don't know really what to say. Like, I don't really have any stories from this. Uh, Melee got the cool setup, because of course they did. Look at this. You got the kitchen in the background and the booths. They got, like, it looks like it's, it's like the foyer, right? And then we're locked away in the goddamn side room with Melee in the background. Huh? <laughs> Come on! When's it our turn? Coney about to have his Dr. Eleanor. Relax. But it was a great event. They treated us very well. These juvies, tasty. Seriously. These juvies are yummy. And I know you think I'm shilling, but I'm not paid to say that now. You should eat them. Drink them. <laughs> I thought you were just shilling. No, they're good. Sincerely. They're not, like, hard. Like, when you drink them, they're not uh, tough to go down. They're not sharp. Were you on eight juvies? I think I was on four juvies. I think I had four juvie one day. What flavor are they? Read the screen. All will be revealed. Again, I'm not even being paid for this. So, go ahead. Are you going to start your own food brand like every other massively popular influencer? I'll just go into G Fuel. I'll show lead to children. Mmm. <laughs> Doesn't G Fuel have lead? Is that true? I don't know if that's true. Is that... Is that... No, it's not? Okay. <laughs> Age God says Norway is suing Nintendo? What? Really? <laughs> this is from 2018. What? Nintendo finds itself in hot water with Norway. 2018. Oh, it's pre-ordering from the shop. If this is if this is what he's talking about, it's old news. If it's not what he's talking about, Norway hates Nintendo. This is the second time they've been mad. Why that picture? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's going on in Norway, but thank God it's censored. Phew. I just looked up, does G Fuel have it and lead is the second most searched option? Yeah, part of me is feeling like you guys aren't like, because you guys all haunt me. I think you guys are just uninformed. That was like a huge conversation before. It was a thing. You guys weren't around for it. You guys are babies. Epic Games got sued, and apparently we, the players, are getting some of the money. Yeah, okay. I'll get 10 bucks from a settlement. Oh, if you guys are wondering where the YouTube video is... Yeah! Yeah, me too! We were supposed to put out the video yesterday, and then today. It's been a, a fucking mess. It's not Vincent, it's not the editor. It's, it's, uh, it's something else. <laughs> It, you'll see. They're supposed to have a video by now. Stupid. Um, ad starts in two minutes. I, you know I don't even have to say it. Thank you, Kiwi Rory. That is a hard name to say, but I appreciate it. Ad starts in two minutes. You know how to get around it. I don't even have to say it, but if you... Yeah, Knockout Joe. There we go. You get it. You get it. Um, so, uh... I have been... Ever since I, I left Panda, dude... I, I have all these ideas that have bubbled up to the surface and now I'm working on all of them at the same time and I don't know how to do it. Like, I have literally six or seven ideas that I'm working on and not small ideas, like, like commitments. And I don't know how to, like, I'm just shotgunning it. And I'm like, I don't know how to do this. It's bad. I have no control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, like, some of them are small. Some of them are, like, long streams or whatever, but... I'm not gonna use this. Why would you ever do this? 
This is just worse. I can't. I'm not going to add it. No. You guys want redundant emotes. That is kind of funny. That's hilarious. LMAO. I'm going to add that channel point thing where you can only request things if you have points. And you get banned if it doesn't hit. You guys need some self-control. Yeah, see, it's so stupid. You can pop I can't and it'll just look the same. This is so dumb. It's stupid. You guys are dumb. Uh-oh, add start to 10 seconds. Oh, quick, 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 fast, fast. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Go fast, go quick. Have you been keeping up with Elon? Oh, boy. Go ahead and go. I'll, we'll talk about it when the ads are done. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, baby. They removed your base did. I don't believe you unless somebody said it in a TTS. I only believe that if somebody sends a dono saying so. Nobody would lie for money. Happy Come Tuesday, everybody. Come Tuesday. <laughs> I love it. My free hat arrived today. Congratulations. You earned it, I think. I don't remember. Did you actually earn it? I'm not sure if you earned it or if you stole it from somebody. They did? Okay. I remember somebody stole a hat. But... Yes, but the bit was that I stole it. Okay, that's what it was. Okay. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Thanks, Bird. Will you be doing Christmas karaoke? What does that mean? No. I don't do karaoke. What song would I even do? The cum preacher is so funny. That's what I'm saying. I can't. I want to put out this fucking React Wars. That was supposed to be the video on Monday. And I was just sitting around because the fucking people who have to review it are in Europe. And I'm in the US. And my editor is in Australia. This is an international incident. It's so dumb. Cody, you should add this emote. Is it this? Is that what you said? This like that? Oh, it's just HBox passing out. No. No free clout. Wait a minute. Did... Did HBox only have 416 subs? <laughs> no way, right? That's the hype train, right? What the fuck? How long ago was this? It was a train. Okay, goddamn. I bet the train went off the rails after he passed out. What the fuck? <laughs> probably, <laughs> probably crashed into a building. That's his subula. His subula is just screaming nonstop. If I had the lung capacity, God, I would be right along there with him. But sadly, I'm a vampire. <laughs> Speaking of vampires, I played Bloodstained on the flight again. Because Bloodstained, everybody said it's fun. Dude, that game runs like shit on the Switch. It's so bad. It's awful. God, man. What were they thinking? Get a Steam Deck? I don't have enough money! <laughs> I want a Steam Deck. It feels so decadent for me to get a Steam Deck. I don't even know if I would use it. I want one. But first, I need a job. There are all these industry jobs that I see, too. And I'm like, do I go industry? But the streaming, I'm enjoying streaming. If I go industry job, I got to spend 40 hours a week doing industry stuff. And then I won't be streaming as much, you know? I'm like, ah, I don't know. It's a tough spot. I don't know. You'll be wanting a job when that decay hits in three weeks. Hey, I'm, I'm living high for three weeks, though. These three weeks are bliss. Just can't wait. Just quit your job. I did quit my... I don't have a job. <laughs> That's the problem. I'm unemployed. When am I ever going to get my Steam Deck? Maybe for Christmas. Coney is destitute. That's what I'm saying. I was good this year. Santa will come. 
Okay. Um, ads are over. Guys, I got a question. Uh... <laughs> Is this real? Is that real? He looks like a guard in Goldeneye. <laughs> Are we sure that's real? <laughs> that looks like a rubber mask. Yeah, I don't... Uh, is he... <laughs> is he real? I don't know. It's edited? I think it is, but I can't tell. Maybe he was turning really quick. Maybe. He's deflating. Yeah, I don't I don't know. He looks like one of those clown boppets that you can you know what I mean? Is this COVID related? Uh yeah, dude. Uh, I, <laughs> he made a poll. Okay, so so I don't let's not get political, okay? On the Coney stream. But just generally speaking, that why is he posting plankton? He read the word plankton. He actually read the word plankton here and then he posted plank oh my god. He's so cool. So he made a poll. Where'd the poll go? Wait, did he didn't delete it, did he? He's just tweeted a lot since. So I made a poll. Should I step down his head as Twitter? Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Vince Russo is trending. I shouldn't click on trends. Something bad could happen. Should I step down his head of Twitter? I will abide by the results of this poll. See, the problem here is that he wins either way. This is a catch-22, right? Either people vote no, and he keeps doing the thing that he's doing, and, and seeking love and affection and attention, or people vote yes, and he gets to abandon the trash fire and go back to Tesla. And people just kind of jumped on this. People, they were like, oh yeah, please. Like, I, I don't know. There's no right answer here. You understand that, right? He wins either way. He was already looking for a new CEO. The poll didn't mean shit. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I, <laughs> this thing is so silly. But even then, that's what I thought was happening, right? I thought that was like 300 IQ, whatever. Just get the public to agree with you. But then somebody's like, oh, I bet this is a lot of bots. And he's like, hmm, maybe you're right. The only people who can vote in the future will have blue. Surely he tweeted about that, right? I don't, I don't know. It's all just bullshit. I, whatever. I only know what other people tell me. <laughs> The whole thing is a fucking mess, dude. I can't... Uh, what? It's so weird, man. Like, I can't... I don't want to care, and I don't want to track it, because it's just not... It's above me. But fuck me, man. From wherever I am sitting, this is the saddest thing. <laughs> it's the saddest story currently in the news. Losing billions of dollars, he still wins. Okay. Obviously, losing billions of dollars is an L for you and me. For him, he still has billions more. You can live comfortably an entire lifetime with one billion. <laughs> you understand that, right? You only need one billion. He has like a hundred of them. Not even? I mean, if you have all the, the shit that he has, you could just... Scale down! Comfortably. Are you kidding? What? Are you all billionaires in the chat? <laughs> That's why I can't get a Steam Deck. I'm not a billionaire yet. Losing billions is still lost to Elon because his ego is hurt. Not if the public loves him. He's been to the top of the mountain. He's had all the money in the world. Now he just wants to win the common man. Hearts and minds, gentlemen. That's what he wants. I've been working on scripts this weekend. One of them is done. I'm very excited. I've, been, I've had so much energy, man. Like I, I just, like I said, I just want to shotgun all this shit that I that's in my head. There's so much shit in my brain. 
It's crazy. Um. <laughs> Look at him! Look at him! <laughs> I, I, I genuinely wish I could figure out how to look like that regularly. Like, if I could just go like this, and it would make me show, look like that, I would do it every photo. Like, I, I don't... I'm not even making fun of him. This is, this is a feat, you know? Do your ch double chin trick. You mean this? <laughs> me in 20 years. Have you guys not seen that? Oh, new friends, new viewers. Look at you guys. Press your tongue to the roof of your mouth. You can do it too. I've just got a strong tongue. You guys haven't seen my tongue, right? I got a, I got a cow tongue. Shit's huge. You just push it up. Yeah. <laughs> Yo! Finally! I want to offer promotion of your channel, viewers, followers, views, chatbots. The price is lower than any competitor. Their quality is guaranteed to be the best. Auto on. Incredibly flexible and convenient order management panel. Everything is your hands. Turn it on, offer, customize. Go to dogehype.com. Don't mind if I do. Am I allowed to do this? Am I allowed to show view botters? On Twitch? I'm not gonna do it. I just it exists. <laughs> if I get banned for this, I'm gonna be so mad. If I get banned for that, I'm gonna be so fucking mad. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Twitch, this is your fault. You made view botting look so attractive to me. Because I don't have any viewers. Help! YouTube streamer Coney. I don't have a deal to go over there. Happy Tuesday, everybody! Yeah, the, uh... So, anyway, the Ludwig event was fun. Um... I don't really have any stories because I was only there for one day. I had the juvies. They were yummy. Um, the tournament itself was kind of, uh, I don't know. It was one of those tournaments where, and I feel like this happens a lot in Ultimate. Maybe it's just me. You can kind of tell the guy who's going to win. You know what I mean? You, as you see it happening, you can kind of make sense of like, oh, this guy's clearing everybody, right? Spargo was just kind of beating ass. <laughs> uh, Leo was in his silly era. Yeah, I don't know. Somebody said it, Leo was high. I don't want to give attention to that because I don't know if it's true. But now I've said it on stream in front of a thousand people. Apparently, that might have been possible. I don't know if it's true. He was faded than a hoe. <laughs> Leo said, shall we? <laughs> Cheers, my friends. He picks Marth against Olimar. <laughs> but the Hittington, the Selectington, the Marthington. According to Riddles, Leo is a full-on stoner. <laughs> what if that is the downfall of Leo? He's on top of Ultimate forever, right? And then he gets one hit of the Devil's Lettuce. It's like a Dare cartoon. We need Bugs Bunny and Garfield to talk him out of it. Someone, please stop him. The Ninja Turtles have to save him. That cartoon would stop me. I, unironically, it literally stopped me. Dare worked on me. I don't drink or smoke, and a large part of it is those cartoons. I'm not kidding. Alvin and the Chipmunks got through to me. It worked. I was influenced. Wait, what? Did I? What are these sounds? <laughs> I 
I usually have the chat up on this monitor, but I don't know what happened to it. Yeah, the tournament was good. I was kind of pissed off, and I, I, I don't know if I want to say this because this gives people power. But I was on the Reddit, and I saw people like, thoughts on the Scuff World Tour commentary. I'm like, oh, fuck. I don't want to click on this. But I have to. I have to see it. And there was one moment when we were commentating where we went off on a bit on Avatar and James Cameron. And after, like, 30 seconds, I'm like, all right, let's get back to the point. I don't want to catch any strays on Reddit. That one bit, somebody commented and, like, wow, they were on James Cameron and Avatar for, like, three minutes. That was the one thing! That was the one fucking thing! Unbelievable! What happened to our community? What happened? I don't know where I am anymore. And I'm half joking. I'm only half joking here. I don't know who I'm serving anymore on the mic. It's crazy. Did you get one guide? I think so. Like, I, and like you know, I don't, I don't mind criticism. I genuinely don't. I don't care. Some people have preferences. Some people don't. But the one fucking thing. The one thing. Come on. All right, but I'm, do I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I, I shouldn't. I know I shouldn't, and I knew better. I got one guy. I one guy. How was Mario Party? Bullshit. Oh, wait a minute. You guys didn't see it. Wait a minute. I have the VOD. Wait a minute. I need to show you guys this. Oh, my God. This was so stupid. This is so stupid. So I saved the VOD in case, like, you know, I, I won the summit. Password. <laughs> and uh, I, I, w I wanted to just make YouTube content. And fucking... <laughs> this is so stupid. I'm, I'm legitimately furious. Did you win? No, but I should have. This is so stupid. Hold on. Let me bring it up. Okay, I have the VOD here, okay? It's me, uh, All Tribe Spooky, and 360 Chris in, okay? So we're all playing. This is round one. I'm recording on my own in case I want to put it on YouTube. I am, hold on, let me go in the center. I am Donkey Kong, okay? And this is one of those Mario Party games. This is so stupid. This is one of those Mario Party games where everybody near the end, look at this. It's so close. Two stars, two stars, one star, one star, right? Everybody's close. Uh, and he has a boo bell, right? So, like, this is exceptionally close all the way through. And we get to the end. I'm in first here. Oh, wait, no, I'm not Birdo. I'm usually Birdo. I'm DK, so I'm down here. I'm in fourth, whatever. And the thing is, I may be in fourth, but, hold on. No, I need you guys to experience this with me. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'm in fourth, okay, but I have 20 coins and a warp star, and, or a warp pipe, and, and, I'm a going to get a, I'm a going, I'm going to get a, get a star next turn, okay? Because I can go around, and I can get the pipe, uh, and the warp star. Or I should have gotten two, but it didn't work out, whatever. So basically, if I get the star here on the next turn, which I will, I'm beating all tribe, because I have four more coins, right? But then, this happens... He's not gonna fly. <laughs> no way! My mic is muted. It's on a different audio channel. No! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Last turn of the game, by the way! Last turn of the fucking <laughs> game! No <laughs> Last turn of the fucking game! I'm actually sick to my fucking stomach. So stupid. Yeah, you get a and I get a star and I'm in third.
Then really I get a bonus star, right? Look at these results. Okay. Hold on. Password. Password. Pass. Pass. Password. How do I fucking skill star? Password. No. Go. Okay. Look at these results. Do you see this? I got third by ten coins. I genuinely, I, because he got a bonus star. Also, I had two stars stolen for me from this guy. I don't know why he only came after me. Also, I only lost by 10 coins because I had to play this dual mini game for how many coins? Wait. <laughs> this game is for six coins. That's true. This duel is for six coins. And I'm on the inside track. Numbers. <laughs> The inside track is so much harder. Wait, this is kind of. <laughs> he got 12 coins out of that game and then beat me by 10. I fucking hate Mario Party. I don't ever want to play again. It's a fucking disaster. So stupid. That's true, though. The inside is way harder. Yes! I'm not doing the. I'm not doing it next time. I'm not doing no Mario Party Summit thing. Uh, by the way, I'm going to go ahead and reveal something that we've been working on for a while. Guys, welcome to... Can I, can I make this bigger? I've realized I never showed this on stream. Thank you, CJ. Uh, but I didn't say any of this. Thank you, CJ. Thank you, On the Road Again. Thank you, Honra. Thank you, Toxic Waste. Thank you, Dalty Sock. Thank you, Glintendo. Thank you, Nuclear Melon. Thank you, Rogue Rhythm. Thank you, Mateo and Gold. Thank you, Chimera XD. Thank you, Boxy Loxy. Thank you, Sisalol667. And that's all I'm going to do. Torito Island? No, that's later. <laughs> I'm not kidding. We're doing that later. Welcome to the Discord Digest. It's on the Discord. It's a new thing. I don't know if you guys have seen it. Basically, we have a thing now where uh, we, we had like a Reddit thing. We had a Reddit, but nobody ever checked the Reddit. Nobody ever cared about the Reddit. So we we're like, all right, we're not going to do a Reddit. And now, if you poggies under things, they show up here. Including this lovely little photo from Dodo. Look at all the poggies that he got with this lovely serve butt. <laughs> Fuck, more things to mod. Yeah, your job isn't hard enough. I pay you too much for what you do. I thought he had tits. Now that you said that, me too, actually. I didn't think that at first, but now that you said I kind of get it. Yeah. But a very cute picture. I love Servbot. He's so cute. This scared me. <laughs> I didn't... You know, I, I was like, oh. Cowboy Toad is, like, from Mario Party. Uh, that's fine. Hal made that game. Cowboy Toad is not real Toad. There's a distinction. And then I saw that. And I'm like... Oh. <laughs> Hudson did not howl. Even better, Hudson's dead, I think. Hell yeah. Was. Ha ha ha. Dead as of 2012. What are they gonna do? Get out of here. Ten years ago? Statue's dead. <laughs> L. <laughs> what are you going to do about it? Konami owns Hudson now. They've got bigger problems. Like Kojima. Damn, down 300 million. <laughs> and that's yen, so that's like $300. Damn, I never noticed how symmetrical Toad is. Have you guys ever seen that? He's like, you could like cut him right down the middle. He'd be the same on both sides. Is that, a, is he always like that? Huh. What's this? This is so stupid. Why did you get, uh, well, I guess you didn't poggies this. People didn't poggy, everybody just stared at this. Is that good? 
I don't know if stare is a pun. Maybe that means you're just watching it a lot. Stupid. Cool spider my friend has. <laughs> cool. Yeah, man. Awesome. That is a cool spider. That is so cool. I don't think it's cool just a plushie. <laughs> Never mind. Nirad said it wasn't cool, so it's cool now. That's better. I like that better. <laughs> That's pretty good. Dude, his mouth. Jamaica, no problem. That's not even like a like a pun. That's not even a joke. <laughs> it's not even like Jamaican me. You make a no problems. Uh, I don't like Pikachu with dreadlocks either. I do like fat Pikachu though. That Pikachu is over the clouds. <laughs> Yeah. That Pikachu's got no problems. Higher than Leo. All right, let's not do that. I don't want to make that a thing here. I don't want to make that, like, a thing that we say. I just like fat Pikachu. I think he's cute. That's nice. So anyway, if you want your stuff to show up, just Poggy's fun stuff. There's me. <laughs> well, this got Poggy's. I don't know if that counts. These are the things that are up there, but one of them is a Spyro 3 level tier list. I, oh my god, what the fuck is this? It's a Wii Fit Trainer Discord? I'm not reading that. This is by Recency? Yeah, you guys don't have anything good up here. <laughs> maybe it'll make next uh, month's digest. Just like the good stuff and maybe we'll look at it. Because I've been going through these, and you guys have some bet. Like, like, I'm not going to add this as an emote. Not every React Wars video gets to be an emote. How many servers are you in? Too many. Because I don't want to leave them and get in trouble. One of them is, uh, here's Peggle for Doug Doug. <laughs> uh, I, I don't want to be the first to leave it. Because th this is bad things happening to good people. <laughs> um, hmm. Hold on. There's, uh, uh... Twitch Rivals, which I haven't been in for years. Hoarder confirmed. I just don't, like, I don't want to, like... I don't know. Everybody gets notified if I leave. And what if everybody's going to laugh at me when I go? They're like, oh, thank God he's gone. And they make fun of me. You know? This is the Strikers Cup for Grand Pooh Bear. The one that I won. You remember that, right? <laughs> they don't get notified? What if they do? They're going to make fun of me. I don't know what the fucking... What if they all have a great idea right when I leave? Like, they, they try to organize another one right after I leave, and they're like, oh, oh, I would invite Coney, but he's not here, right? <laughs> I don't want to do that. Somebody asked why there's so many Coney discords. There's two, and you shouldn't know about this one. This one's moated off. This one has a drawbridge. <laughs> You're not allowed to enter. You stay in there. No one can go in or out. Well, out. You can get kicked out, actually. <laughs> People have. At least put them in folders. Well, I don't fucking know how to organize them. There's too many. Wait a minute. Is today Wednesday? No. Okay. <laughs> Phew. Okay. I was going to say, I think I missed a show I'm supposed to be on, but I didn't. Okay. Phew. Okay. Drop your primes, fellas, says Lulu. That's so true. I haven't said it. Good reminder, everybody, drop the primes right now. It's prime time, baby. It's time to prime. Now is the prime time to prime. That's a great idea. Why are there bird noises on the Diddy Kong Racing soundtrack? Already did. Well, then uh, drop a gifty. Because you got that for free. There are birds in the game? There's a lot of animals in the game. 
Okay. All right, you guys ready? <laughs> this one's for me. Now I'm thinking of the Reactor Wars vid. Was there a vid with this song? I don't remember. <laughs> it's not Watch Mojo. We just did that. Can you imagine how dire things would be if I had to watch Mojo every stream? I actually, literally, like, I, I curate Watch Mojo. It doesn't seem like it, but I'm picking movies, like, very delicately and very carefully. They're not all worth it. They're not all great. Mojo is my favorite content. You're like one of the only ones. There was a there was a content tier list that came out like people were doing, and Mojo was universally at the bottom. <laughs> it was crazy. Samir fell off, dude. I talked to Jarvis. Uh, Jarvis Johnson was at uh, the Ludwig thing, and I was talking to him about Darman for like a weird long amount of time. <laughs> he was like, "Yeah, he talks like that." I was like, damn. Jarvis is cool as hell. I love that guy. I would love to hang out with him. I told him about uh, Samir and... What was the one with the girl with the powers? I don't remember. <laughs> I forget what, what that guy's... What that channel's name was. But the girl had, like, power to make people stupid. You remember? Something void. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Darman has an hour-long Christmas special? Oh my god. That rules. Oh, dude. Watch it now. I'm not gonna watch it now. We're not gonna watch an hour-long Darman Christmas special. We'll watch it next year. All I want for Christmas is for us to watch that. That's your one gift? Maybe next year. You guys weren't good this year. Okay. Tonight's for me. Well, this one's for me. Okay? You guys weren't good this year. Maybe if we hit 4K. If we could get a 4K stream. Now that's a good chat. You can say you can't say we were bad with that sub count. It's all gone next month. You think all these people are staying? All right. Shut up. Shut up. This one's for me. Oh baby. That's the good shit. Oh, yeah. Magic. Fellas, I don't know if you noticed, but I just hit 100,000 subscribers. Wait, did I get a... Oh, I thought I got a raid. I was looking because the chat blew up. Start over. Fellas, I don't know if you noticed, but I just hit 100,000 subscribers. It's true. Check below here. It slowed down a lot, but it's still 100,000. Woohoo! You know what that means. It's time for a new house! It's time to get a new house. It's time to make some irresponsible financial commitments that will follow me for three decades of my life. But I can't just have any house. Oh no, I'm a content person, which means I need a content house. That's why we're gonna look at Zillow Gone Wild and find the next house, my next abode here on this Reddit, which documents amazing homes. Now, last time we did, uh, we did all time and we found some great stuff. That video already exists. I just want to show you this one from a year ago. Ho! Oh. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, my God. Living in a museum. By the way, if you haven't seen that YouTube video, uh, they said in a comment, they killed every animal in this house. They said that. They literally said that.
So these people are genocidal. They're trying to kill the entire planet, I think. Those are three ostrich heads. I didn't notice that before. That feels like toss. Look at all the skulls. But that's not what we're looking at today because we've already seen it. We're going to sort by year because it's been a year since we looked for a house. And uh, before, why did I do it before? I think I hit 50,000 subs. I think that's why I did it before. And now we're at 100. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, let's take a look. I'm not reading tweets. It gets more and more obvious. Is there something like in the house? Like a oh, <laughs> is it the is it that it's uh? Yeah, this feels like bad marketing. Oh, very silly, haha. -ha. I guess, but dude, this isn't good marketing. I'm not gonna buy your house. Is this on Zillow? This is a terrible way to sell your home. Who would buy that? Holy shit, it's Jason. It is Jason. With his signature kitchen knife. Is that alcohol? Is it, this is a shitty bar. <laughs> it's like a CRT TV with no stools. Dad humor? Yeah, this... No, I don't think it's dad humor. Well, I guess it is. This struck me more as like millennial like... Narwhal bacon humor. But, no, I think you're right. This is more dead. <laughs> Wait a minute. What a weird place to store your weights? <laughs> In your living room, under your floating... console? Work out and watch? I, I guess, but, like... Uh, the heaviest one there has to be, like, 15, maybe 20 pounds? I don't know. Always on the grind. <laughs> Wait, why? <laughs> I shouldn't click on this. Why am I looking? What? All right, this is the first time I've just read something from, from chat. Is this a bomb shelter? Oh my god, it is. Bro, it's like a vault in Fallout. Can I live here? <laughs> This is a fixer-upper. There's the road. <laughs> oh, baby. Uh, wait, what? Do you get the this, too? You get all this? You get all of this. <laughs> all right, I don't know how I feel about this shower. This shower needs a bit of work, I think. I think first we fix the shower. The toilet faces the shower. <laughs> I don't know how much room your knees have there. You might have to go side saddle. You might have to poop at a 90 degree angle. Class rat cycle works. How much of this do you get? Damn! This place is full of Easter eggs. This place probably has like mag codex everywhere that you can read and one bobblehead. That ups your charisma. That's really what you're paying for. It, wait, is this a nuclear missile? Dude. Hold on, I gotta drive to the shower. Hey, that's a good way to get you out of bed. The nuke is still there. Then it better be cheap. Sold. <laughs> Damn it. It won't tell me how much it's sold for? 380 in... February. Wait, do you buy the nuke? <laughs> Can you buy... Is the nuke? Because, like, the nuke has to be a 100,000 of that. The nuke is a free bonus. It's a perk. I don't know. Can you fix rust? Isn't there, like, like you pour soda on it or something? Just, like, get, like, a power washer full of Coca-Cola. It just... <laughs> I think that works. The nuke is a loss leader. Yeah, yeah. Dude, look at those taxes. Eesh. But goddamn, that'd take a bit. It, it's delicious. You can take <laughs> one for you, one for me. <laughs> That's delightful. Hope we find another nuke house. I don't think I should live there, though. Because, you know, people are going to come in to move with me because the channel points. And then we all might die, and then I'll get blamed, and then I'll be sued, and I'll be dead, so they'll go after my estate. 
You know what I'm saying? It'd be tough. Anyway, this sucks. I would not sell my Zillow like this. Just your average 20,000 square foot, $15 million mansion in Florida on this. Okay, what's wrong with this house? <laughs> I think the inside is themed somehow. Cult, you think? I think it's themed somehow. But I don't know how. Dungeon? You think like a sex dungeon or a nor like a medieval, like a queen dungeon? <laughs> There's got to be something in here. Elvis themed alligator house? <laughs> You buy a $15 million house that is full of alligators? What a jip. A bowling alley? No, dude, bowling alleys would be amazing. People would love those. It's full of more animals. Again? <laughs> hold on. All right, uh, hold on. Let's go through. Lovely. Good pool. L That's a rainforest cafe. <laughs> Huh? Ah, uh, who said Star Wars? Who said Star Wars? Raise your hand. Somebody said Star Wars. Congratulations. Good guess. The dad's a geek. Not even the kid. Isn't that the saddest part? The kid doesn't care about Star Wars. I'm convinced that Star Wars is only popular because of dads now. Oh, there's a slide though. Wee! <laughs> Damn, that's a bunk. Imagine being the bottom bunk of a Star Wars bedroom. The life you could have lived if you didn't have your younger brother. Oh my god. I'd never forgive him. I want to be the captain. <laughs> I want to be Han Solo. This is less geek and more mega nerd. I think you're a turbo nerd, the fact that you have a distinction. <laughs> That's the worst one of all. Uber nerd. It's all nerds. Cool sink, though. Is that a sink? Resist. You can't put your kid in that room. What if your kid doesn't do their homework and they go in there and they see the sign that says resist and they're like, you know what? Yeah. <laughs> Yo! Every little princess's dream! Oh my god. Th what? Every toy's dream too? Dude, whose bedrooms are the... It's just a Disney house. Is that a bed? Do you sleep in the carriage? That looks like a shower. I don't... Is it? Is that a toilet? It's a toilet! Oh, it's a bathtub. Okay. Never mind. Phew. <laughs> I thought it was a, a big-ass toilet. Damn. Your throne, your majesty. I wonder if it's heated. <laughs> You know what? Disney could sue these people. They're using Rex and Forky and Buzz. Well, that's not really Buzz. Disney could come in. It turns into shit at midnight. What if this room just becomes pumpkins? Like, it's real? Just these rotting, fetid pumpkins rotting all over the room. Uh, that's a spoiler if you haven't seen the movie. Dude. That's the bathtub or hot tub. That's nice. $15 million nice? No. But if you're loaded beyond belief and have some needy kids, that's your play. What is this table for? That edge of sketch is a TV, right? Surely. Surely that's a TV. 30,000 square foot one bed. Oh, we got TikToks on here now? This is new. The meta's changed. This better be funny. Make my entrance for damn near a year now, and never have I seen something as atrocious as this. Hold on, turn that up. This house. This motherfucker is 3,000 square feet and has one bedroom, but got 91 pictures for it. <laughs> And by the exterior, Wait, uh, you're thinking, oh, this is like a traditional ranch style. Yeah, it looks chill, normal. It's mellow. I've seen this 70s style home. It looks nice. Because you get inside and you enter into a 70s pizza hut that's crossed between a haunted mansion. Yeah, a little weird. This living room with this rogue ass spiral staircase in it. But the piece they resist. Yeah, this looks dangerous. This little staircase right there. That's kind of 
haunting. Glances <laughs> down that red hallway up top. Okay. This part is where it gets really kooky and crazy, so keep up. All right. Behind the hallway wall is like this weird ass double vanity in this extendo closet. Okay, Behind it is this weird ass open area that you really didn't need, but the reason this open area exists is because to the right of this wall, this weird ass open concept shower and bathtub <laughs> basin. <laughs> it's like a, it's like a it's a separated tub. How do you get water in there? Like it's not connected to the wall or anything. It's like a cartoon tub. Yeah, this is what like Arthur Morgan takes a bath in. No doors on a wooden floor. That shit's gonna rot. <laughs> oh my god. Why not put a wall up here? If that's the shower, do you like it's just ugh. the wood's gonna warp. Ugh. Across from it is just this. Here's the actual listing. Yeah, I kind of want to go through it myself, but hold on. Well, th yeah, this is three minutes long. I want to explore myself. Thank you. All right, let's take a look. Kalamazoo, Michigan. Let's explore. <laughs> All right. I think I spoiled myself. I think I think I got spoiled a little early. I I his video was definitely leading up to this. This Tarzan treehouse? This is like when Tarzan has been civilized for a few years by Jane. Me and still want to live in tree. But no, Tarzan. You have to live with us. Hmm. <laughs> Me and live in house tree. This is pretty... Dude, that doesn't look supported. This is... <laughs> this looks like a roller coaster tycoon house. What is that? It's pretty, though. I like it. Yeah, go up there. All right, we're walking through. Same thing. I don't like the random uh, whatever that is there. Stone? Whatever's going on there is a problem. <laughs> There's the hole in the floor. <laughs> That's a pressure plate. Yeah, you hit this and darts come out of the... <laughs> These aren't electrical outlets. It's just... it's It's poison. Yeah. <laughs> the doorways look like paintings. <laughs> That's true. It's a wily e. coyote ass house, dude. My sim ass would bump into those and hurt Glusha Kadurva. <laughs> Walk back into the kitchen. <laughs> Leave my plate on the floor. This place haunted. This is weird. I don't like this because it's asymmetrical. This is weird, man. Look at that. Make the fireplace longer, maybe? Ugh. Oh, that's pretty, though. I bet it's gorgeous when it snows, dude. All right, what's down there? Let's go. No well, is that an elevator? Where does that go? <laughs> They're inviting us in. Oh my god, they have one with the door and one without. <laughs> Alright, long ass hallway. Yeah. Closet with no door. Just a curtain. I dig it, actually. Double vanity. Gorgeous. Uh, th This is the bathroom. Yeah, with the copper bathtub. I bet you smell worse than you, th you did when you got in. There, actually. <laughs> Bro, that joint is copperific. That joint's gonna stay. You ever, you ever touch a doorknob and the smell of the doorknob stays on your hand for a very long time? Yeah, you're gonna smell like a penny, dude. Yeah. <laughs> That's bad. It's like small, too. Why can't you put a curtain around this? Why is the curtain on the closet? You put the bath curtain on the closet. <laughs> All right, what did, oh, there's the toilet. Toilet detected. Okay, I was wondering. Okay. <laughs> and, and can you guess? Can you guess what's covering the toilet? It's a curtain. It's another curtain. I see the rod. Another curtain, yeah. <laughs> Do you this, think this house is insulated well? I can't tell what the fuck is going on up here. There's, like, recessed lighting and also other... What's the opposite of recess? Abscess lighting 
And, um, uh, that? Is that fire alarm? <laughs> this place is nipple lights. Yeah. Okay. Uh, more stairs. Okay. Another fireplace. Shall we? Damn, a sunroom. Now this shit is Haunted Mansion. This is that elevator room with the dude hanging. I always want to make Disney references, but you guys make fun of me. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I want to, though. Disney adult. Shut up. I just like the parks. <laughs> the parks are neat. Why is there a window in the door? I guess that's normal, but that's a weird spot to put it. Like right there? Seance room? I was thinking of the, the, the ghost host. There's always my way. And then the fucking... The fucking... You know. <laughs> I can't believe I had those on hand. Not a bad kitchen. Not bad. A little weirdly shaped. But <laughs> a mirror down there. Don't know why that's there. Got to check the fit from a 45-degree angle? <laughs> the foot mirror, yeah. I, uh, Coney, look at the ceiling. Oh, my God, that shit looked like chocolate. That shit going to melt. Looks delicious. Wait, 36 out of 92. Oh, my God, we're going to be stun-locked on this. I didn't know this was going to be this long. <laughs> Let's speed this up. All right, a, a shitty pantry. A nice pantry with something that you just get from Walmart inside. Uh, there's another shower. Normal on that one. Weird sink. Where's the bedroom, by the way? Uh, there's the wine cellar and a big... A Is that a pool? Swimmies? Yo! With another fireplace. What is going on? There's a fireplace and a dragon. There's a fireplace in every room. I'm all about indoor pools, though. That's nice. What's happening with this window? Oh, never mind. I thought the window was, like, shiny. Like, God really wanted you to see something down there. But no, that's, like, plexiglass. All right, keep going. An another fireplace. Uh, okay. Uh, storage room with... Does anyone know what these are? Garage? Yeah, but what's that? Three attics? All right. Uh, gar garage under construction. Uh, cat room. Cat room detected. This place, I know that shit smells. Uh, closet? D basement? Where are we? Ah, here we are. I now know where we are. By the way, fireplace number six, if you're keeping count. We are now downstairs. There's... <laughs> Also, there's another staircase. All roads lead to downstairs. All right, two closets. Another sink. Uh, okay, yeah. Uh, 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 the yellow room, which is like a corporate office. It's like a conference center. Uh, board basement. Outside. We're outside now. Street lamp. Gorgeous. Love it out here. I love this gazebo. Very pretty. We got out. We escaped. <laughs> By the way, I don't... Damn, it's like on the lake. That's pretty. All right, well, I didn't see a bedroom. <laughs> I didn't ever... I, didn't, I don't think I saw a single bedroom in there. So... How much was this for? 400000 Damn, that shit. That... Th I thought it was bigger than that. Three, two, twenty... Sleep in the bathtub. I, I guess. All right. What I thought $1 million would get me as a kid versus reality. Oh. This is adulting, LOL. Yeah. Such a cute living room. What is that? Uh. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, I, I see it. It was hiding behind the bush. It was behind the foliage. I didn't, I didn't think it... Okay, I got it. I got it. <laughs> That's when you have to entertain. You can't leave them alone for a moment. You have a kleptomaniac ant. 
Do I tell the potential new owners about the room in the basement or let them find it on their own? Okay. Pretty house. Yeah. Ooh! Mystery! I don't like this, though. There's a skull there. Something bad's gonna happen, dude. There's a fucking skull on the counter. Wait, did they lift the painting? <gasps> oh my god, you lift the painting. Oh, dude. It's lit? <laughs> what? Uh, is there nothing at the end of this hallway? Bowser hallway? Yeah, the floor drops out. <laughs> yeah, there. Wait, is there nothing here? A sex room would be better. Yeah, that's just the devil at the end of the hallway. Nothing there to meet you other than him. This is a layers of fear hallway. Blooper team would fucking love this hallway. You turn around and there's a big thing in front of you. Oh, yeah, this is a puzzle room. There's a cross on the wall when you walk in. Wait, what? Oh my god. Oh my god, is that a hand? Oh! What are these? What are those for? Phones? Oh no, ads are about to pop. Use primes now, use primes now, quick, quick, quick. Ads popped, I forgot. Ads. <laughs> I forgot. Quick, quick. Tough. <laughs> I, I did forget. If I didn't forget, I'd be able to pop it 30 seconds before. I would say ads 30 seconds before. I always forget. Is this like a key card thing? Or is it like a button, you think? Why is there a hand on the cross? It's like upside down, too. I don't know. Some stigmata shit? I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't even know. Like, I'm trying to think, like, I'm trying to be charitable what this could be. And I can't think of anything. It's a hallway that leads to nothing. This is like barbarian. It's just a Satan room, straight up. It's obviously a game room. Obviously, yeah. <laughs> okay. The games of temptation. Hail Satan! I can't say that. I gotta get sponsored again. <laughs> Could you survive this house? Uh, okay. Oh, this is like... Funny Facebook LARPing. Uh, I'm not reading that. Ugly, ugly bathroom. <laughs> I know it smelled crazy in there. Dude, does the... What's going on with... The, the toilet is a sink! What the fuck? Enhance. The toilet is a sink! What the... <laughs> Actually, that's like a modern bidet. Wait a minute. It's a bidet? Oh. Well, well. Sorry, I'm not European. How do you flush in, in a European-style toilet? How do you do that? The sink for your foot? <laughs> Why is this sink sideways? Is that European, too? I feel like you can't... I, I don't know, dude. There's something about this toilet that I don't like, especially with the carpet, because for some reason, I think a toilet needs, like, the, the, the tub, so there's, like, a backsplash. Because if I pee here, it's going to splatter everywhere. You know? It's going to go all over the place. It's not a toilet. It can't just be... A, oh, there it is. <laughs> Wait, that's just a bidet? You poop here, and then you get up and, and put your butt over there? What the fuck? What kind of European ingenuity is that? No wonder you guys lost the war. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm French and I like to keep uh, 
Your inner screen. <laughs> I surrender. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with this. This is so stupid. <laughs> I will surrender every wall except for the wall against a shitty butt. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this, uh, we're gonna abandon this now. I just don't like. I, I my yeah minus two. I get it. My, it's fine. Yeah, I don't. I I feel like wall to wall carpeting in a bathroom is poor planning. <laughs> oh, but two tubs, how romantic! That's delightful. Tiles falling off the wall, jumped off the bidet too fast. Yeah, th this is Dad's solace. Dad gets to poop on the toilet for an hour, and then he shoots up. I have a great idea. And then he goes to work. That that jumps out of the bidet. <laughs> My bathroom had carpeting for decades. Were you poor? Ew. <laughs> Is it, I love these two. Like, these give the affectation of, like, class. You know what I mean? These are, like, these are representing something. Like, this is, like, decor. At least the shit is camouflaged. What, not only on some days. I don't know. I'm not always this shade, you know? <laughs> what if you're sick? Right? What if you eat a lot of Lucky Charms? You guys ever get that? Get the leprechaun poop? Cut that out of the video, please. <laughs> you know I'm what I'm talking about. showing your house today, that. and this might be the most... I think I skipped TikToks. We skipped TikToks. Psychedelic shower with cow tiles? Uh. <laughs> what? Watch this. It's worth it. Okay. What's going on in there? Cows. A cow potty. Well, a cow... Uh, this is the potty, but this is the cow, cow bath. Why is this decorated like an Ikea after, though? This is weird. This looks weirdly modernist. I like the cow... The cow looks like a, like, you ever go to the mall and they're showcasing, co showcasing art from, like, high schoolers? That's the vibe I get here. I guess it's nice. I don't know. Alright, let me watch the TikTok. Visually stimulating house I've ever seen. Okay. Uh, not necessarily in a good way. Let me show I'll you. I'll be the judge of so that. So as soon as you walk in, you can see zebra Ooh. stairs. No. In this amazing <laughs> dining room. Yeah. Maybe ballroom. Ceiling paper. Okay, someone tell me what this is. The red room. I thought it was an elevator, but it's definitely not. Again with the zebra. It's like a big phone booth. Dude, this is a stream room. Oh my god. I need this for my house. I would yeah, stream in there. Oh my god. Zebra anywhere. Oh my god. All right, here's the kitchen. Okay. Yeah. Don't this house is a, this is a Beetlejuice-ass house. I don't know what theme they were going for <laughs> besides clashing. Lovely. I don't know where the... The backyard is actually fridges. pretty cool. There's a pool. Um, nice. It's just closed. Nice. Walking okay. up the stairs. The zebra stairs. Yeah. In a circus tent. Cruella de Vil-ass house. One of the rooms is just... Uh, floor to ceiling, Dalmatians. Just all the way down. Live barking Dalmatians. Still circus theme. Whoa! That shit looked like Wonder Bread. Why is that the bathroom? It's themed. What the fuck? Twister room? <laughs> oh my god. We are in the master bedroom. What's on the floor? That looks like the, the, the carpet to an arcade. Yeah, that's an arcade rug. What? That shit looked like laser tag. Give me this walk-in closet, but leave the rest of the house to someone that's else. That's a walk-in closet! Is that a fireplace in your walk-in closet? You have to keep your clothes warm? Give me this walk-in closet, but leave the rest <laughs> of the house to someone else. Fuck. 
Changing animals. Ah, to cheetah room. Leopard. 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 Uh. uh, could be a cheetah. Both. <laughs> Hold on. I want to get this right, so I'm not embarrassed in the future. Leopard. Cheetah. Leopards have open circles. Cheetahs have dots. Leopard. Now we know. You learned something. Congratulations, everybody. Wow, we all learned together. Oh, God. <laughs> wow. That kind of goes hard. That's some Adams Family shit. There are no words. That's a, uh, you know, I, I've i seen worse. I feel like this is like every member of the family designed a different room. This is very much an Adam's fit. Like this is a this is a Morticia room, right? This shit looked like a, a Wednesday room, right? Tim Burton has house. Let's put on like vague Tim Burton music. I guess it's Danny Elfman. The brother, 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 brother. <laughs> By the way. Uh, side side note, my daughter loves Nightmare Before Christmas. Uh, it's very cute, but she just goes around singing "This is Halloween," and it's not Halloween. It's almost Christmas. <laughs> I d I don't know how to teach her. Don't know how to fix that. I used to be like that. What wrong? <laughs> did you did you come out okay? She is Jack in reverse. <laughs> She's a little Christmas elf bringing Halloween to the Christmas town. That's funny. That's good. That's funny. Coney, it's your daughter. Yeah, allegedly. <laughs> what does that mean? Yikes! One thing is for certain. And it's always going to be a great time when you're invited over to Steve's palace. Is that Steve? What's up, Steve? Damn, Steve is l ripped and loaded. I didn't know which one to say, but it's both. Look at that. Damn, St wait, Steve. Oh, I thought this was like the bathroom, but it's both. Oh. <laughs> it's not just the bathroom it is also the bedroom this is a smug animal crossing character's house uh what's going on in steve's house he has two chairs he has this end of bed seat and a gold bed and steve <laughs> i guess these are his initials um Oh, God, he's like Roman. Look at that. This dude is... A yeah, this guy definitely watches a lot of YouTube, I would think. <laughs> this guy is red-pilled on YouTube. You watch one Sargon video, and now you become Steve. Damn, dude, he has, like, Caesar over there, too? Oh, my God. SPQR is Roman Empire? Oh, okay, I thought it was, like, Steve Peter Quincy Roberts or something. A lot of pillows, yeah. I don't think you need them. Are those gold bars? Those are straight up just gold. <laughs> Who are you trying to impress? What is that throne? <laughs> what? This actually is an Animal Crossing character. You, uh, uh, somebody definitely went into his house and just plucked this shit out of their pocket. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like an apartment to me. This doesn't look real. This is a happy home. Somebody got a happy home designer. <laughs> Steve is living his bed. Dude, that, that can't be comfy. That cannot be comfortable. That looks awful. 
when your daily soak is so important, but you... Oh, I think we've seen this one. Yeah, this one's just like... I don't know how you get in. This one was on the... Ch we, we watched this on a different video. I don't know how you get in this tub. You gotta, like, climb over the bar. <laughs> I don't know about that one. You gotta climb out. You gotta get some on the carpet over there. Bad idea. Didn't see that. <laughs> undo. That's an undo. I'm not touching that one. Does it have a garage? Yes and no. Wait, have I seen this one too? I think I remember one that was a garage in, like, it was a pool in front of the garage. Seven months ago, so no. This is new. Damn, dude. But is it the garage? It is the garage. That's actually not a bad idea. It was similar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Honestly, dude, if I if I had, like, a sideways house, I might do this. If my house didn't face the road... Yeah, because the road's that way. Good idea. This is actually a good idea. This is nice. I don't know why the garage is there. Everybody thinks it's the pool's fault. This is actually the garage's fault. The pool looks like it was, it was here. Well, I was going to say here first, but that's not true. Whatever. The, the, the car's over here. Yeah, the car's right there. <laughs> I think that's cool. I like it. This listing better be close to a fucking... Oh, my God! How modern. Ow, dude. Dude, you're gonna bang your shin. Oh, my God. Your fibula is gonna just crack in it. Fibula or tibula? I always get them mixed up. Your shin bone. <laughs> Imagine getting home drunk. You're going to be waking up everybody in the house. Goosh, goosh, goosh. That shit's just aluminum. How do you carry the bed up there? You throw it. You have to. You got to get a really strong guy, like a circus strong man. Oh, hup. Or just getting home after a tough day at work. You got to cling onto the bar for dear life. Good heavens. <laughs> like, what kills me is there's nothing under them. Is it metal? It's got to be metal. Good luck having a small child in there. No, this is for a couple or, or people that don't want children. Fuck kids. I don't want any kids. I don't want kids so much. My stairs are going to be metal plates. <laughs> this is just like a displate sponsorship right here all the way up. Or pets, that's true. This is what my dog thought stairs were when he was when we first brought him home. He hated stairs. <laughs> it's like rock climbing. That's pretty nice. I like that. Jetson's time capsule. Too busy finding star-shaped decor to not block the entrance or add windows. <laughs> it's all for you, God. Bless this mess. Honestly? This Jetsons, like, retro, futuristic. This is my shit, dude. I like that. It is a fallout house. I'm into that. Don't know why we have the kitchen with the washer and dryer. Seems a little... Oh, my God. Never mind. This bangs. Yo! This rules. I love this. I love these, like, the, the tables that look like something you would see under a microscope. You know what I mean? Why was 70s like that? Why were the 70s all about, like, I don't know, like a ball with a lot of things? Like, that shit looked like COVID. Amoebas, yeah. The Cold War? <laughs> I just feel like the first person looked under, like, a microscope in, like, the 60s, 70s and saw that and was like, oh, shit. I need a table that looks like that. Mid-century modern go hard? I love that shit. It looked futuristic. It works for me. I'm a Jetsons fan. I love that. I would buy this house post haste. Amazing untouched mid-century home. Oh, is this just going to be a nice house? This shit look like water. <laughs> look like lily pads. Uh, yeah, this is just a nice house. Damn, that pool's pretty. Mold? Petri dish-ass floor? 
<laughs> I mean, it's nice, and the pool is good. That always pissed me off when I was watching Breaking Bad, and they have this nice pool and shit. I'm like, on a teacher's salary, dude? This grass is looking a little sus. <laughs> I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> well, maybe. What do you think is actually... It's just got to be concrete, right? Or rocks. Look at down here. Do you guys ever look at, like, Zillow or... Ra I don't know how often you guys go on these sites. I love it when you can clearly tell they're edited or filtered. I love that. It's amazing. Like, the lights are... They make the clouds, like, look like it's daytime. This might be nighttime for all we know. I don't even know if those trees are real. That's terrific. Oh, God, yes. Buying a house right now, and it's hilarious. Yeah, you gotta, like, really look. Lawnmower simulator level. What are you, cutting the grass, like, diagonally? They, like, pleated the grass? It's like when you fold a shirt. That's lovely. I like it. Nothing to see here. Yo! How much? Tell me there's an elevator. <laughs> look at the look at the stairs here. Dude, I want to see inside so bad. That's it. That's the Coney Mansion. Sure, there's got to be. Where is the Zillow? <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only 2 million. Dude! Oh my god! Are you kidding me? This fucking rules! How many subs to buy this house right now? How much is two million? <laughs> Whatever is two million, I'm gonna... Uh, oh, this looks bad. Wait a minute. Is this like an in-law suite? This is bad. This is not a good look right here. I don't know. What's going on here? Was this actually like a watchtower? I guess it had to be. <laughs> what is going on upstairs? Dude, I want this. And a garage? Only like 800,000 subs before taxes. <laughs> uh, get to it, guys! <laughs> We are one uh, point. I, we're, we're part of the way there. We're at 3.36.50. We're part of the way there. <laughs> we're almost close. You're going to have a guy playing Far Cry 7 try and update his map if you live here? Yeah, somebody's definitely going to try to, like, assault the base. <laughs> I'm going to need higher guards at all times. Dude, this room is excellent. Oh, my God. Ah, there we go. We're five steps closer. Thank you, Amazon Zane. Thank you, Root Lemon. Thank damn, double thanks to Zane. Thank you, Beefish. God! They're rolling in! Thank you! Wait, Twitch scammed me? <laughs> thanks, Twitch. Thanks, Jeff. Jeffy B in the building. Now only 799,990 to go. Merry Christmas, I guess. Bless up. Thank you. Damn, dude, that rules. Good bot, good bot. I kind of love it, actually. Yeah, that rules. Carpet wall and psychedelic wallpaper and never updated 1975. I mean, I don't care about this. The, the, the carpet wall. What could that be for? Golfing? Green screen? It, guys, can, let's workshop this. Let's think about this together. In what use case would you want a green screen carpet rather than, oh, I, I don't know, a screen? <laughs> Just a wall? <laughs> Imagine vacuuming. <laughs> Porn, drugs. I feel like it might be like, okay. Hear me out. I'm streaming against this wall, and I'm yelling, and this eats up all the sound. 
might be a good play. You know what I mean? Because it bounces off. Sa it's not sound panels. It's just the, the carpet. <laughs> Dive in. I don't like this. The fact that this is in February of this year. Go on, everybody. <laughs> is that water? I can't tell if that's water. That's standing fetid water. There are so many mosquitoes. Is that... A, like... Would you die? <laughs> is that electricity? I can't... I can't tell if that's like a wire that like... Uh, I mean, I wasn't going in there before, but now I'm definitely not going in there. But... <laughs> oh, it's a public pool! Oh! Oh, all right. Yeah, okay. It's a public pool. Everybody get in. That shit got prions. Yeah, don't drink the water. <laughs> I know it looks so appetizing. This is the resting place of El Chaurile. This is the Lazarus Pit. You throw your dead in there, <laughs> come back in four days, they'll be back. They'll be different, but they'll be back. Just let them come up. <laughs> Dude, there's something about the architecture here that's that's haunting. I mean, I mean, obviously it's dark, but like maybe with good lighting, this might bang. You change that one light bulb, put in a Philips Hue, it's a party room now. <laughs> Can't get more rust belt than a basement bowling alley. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah. Hey, I've seen this movie. I drink your motion. I drink it up. Why do you need two lanes? I've always wondered that. Why do you need two lanes of a bowling alley, right? 1v1? But you can do that in one lane. That's the point of bowling. Two different oil patterns? <laughs> I, I, I feel like you don't need those, right? That's the guest lane. That's got to be a heavy ball, right? Can't you tell by the holes? That joint's probably 30 pounds. Am I wrong? That joint look big. No? 16 pounds. Okay, bowlers. Fucking league players in my chat. You guys eating up all the lanes on Tuesdays? I hate you guys. I'm trying to play with my daughter. Try to go to the bowling alley with my daughter and my wife. Uh, no, we got leagues tonight. Oh, you sons of bitches. 18 bedroom, 32 bathroom, and comes with a free acid trip. D do you need that many bathrooms? I feel like the maximum you would need is like 20 at most. <laughs> Where's the floor? <laughs> Where am I? Where? I think you need that many bathrooms because if I'm walking around this house, I'm shitting my pants. I need a backpack with all of my drawers in the back of it. Oh my god. Please help. The ocean room. Wait, this bangs. Dude, wait. What? Where does the... The tub begin? I can't, because, like, that's a hot tub. This is a pool. Is this water? Is that water? That's not water. Is this water? Where's the water? What's even happening there? The ocean. The part in the middle is for the bartender. Oh, like here? Yo. Oh, that means I have to be a bartender. I'm entertaining. <laughs> I'm paying a bartender. They got a giraffe in this room and a zebra? Seashells? This shit look like Disney Quest. <laughs> if you don't get that joke, you never will. They shut down. Damn, dude! It is under the sea. Is this the whole house? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, God. 
Okay, these things definitely come to life. The pool is theirs. These things definitely come to life. Dude. What is the Roman architecture? These things serve the drinks to each other. There's a horse in there. There's a Julius Caesar bear and monkeys. There's got to be lore here. I see bears and monkeys and one horse. Do you think the bears and the monkeys live in harmony? I, I can't. I, there's got to be something here, right? It's like a Vegas hotel. <laughs> Probably cost six figures for that teddy bear art display. Yeah, I, this this alone is a fortune. How do you even maintain it? Damn, that's pretty. Uh, <laughs> okay, we're out of the ocean room and into whatever this is. Honestly, not bad. I thought this would be worse, but fuck this. What, are you overstimulated by this room? You walk into this room and you instantly just fall on the ground in the fetal position? Weak eyes. You have an inferior brain. Simply process the visual stimulus. Moron. I don't mind that. That's pretty good. Kingdom Hearts room. Yeah, this is where you pick the shield, the sword, or the, um, what is it, book? I don't know. I don't I played that game like 15 years ago. Editor, put in the right thing. <laughs> Unique. Lots of nooks. Wand? Oh, stupid. What? This shit a commune. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Huh? <laughs> uh, okay. The, oh my god. Oh. What's happening here? Frankenstein house? <laughs> What's happening in this room? There's like paintings and shit. There's a mirror. There's a fireplace. There's always a fireplace. House glitched in build mode. <laughs> it has the stairs, right? It's like an AI house. Uh, a, a fine room. Not bad. Could be worse. Mirror. Okay. Yeah, this is. You know what? You know what, though? That's not bad. That's not that bad. That's a nice little place to go when you got to get away from it all. <laughs> they got a watchtower. <laughs> I mean, this is definitely a, a meth house, right? Or a bunch of meth houses that somehow, like, I don't know, a tectonic plate shifted and all these houses just coagulated together. Now... I am we. They're all part of the same residence now. I can smell the spilled beer. Yeah, a lot of dash dreams here, I think. This is a streamer house in the year, like, I don't know, uh, 2060. <laughs> a bunch of uh, former stars pull in, like, you know, 20 viewers. <laughs> this is This is sad, I think, actually. Ready Player One house, yeah. I would live in there, bro. I'd be in there. Absolutely. Please. Put me in this one. There's like a kitchen down here, I think. I don't know. Is there a grill? <laughs> That's kind of nice. By no means the best on this Oh, I'm not clicking. No! What was it? I didn't see it. I didn't see it. What was it? What was it? Hold on. Let me look. Let me look. Okay. I'm allowed to show this. It's a bikini. It's a bikini. It's a one-piece bikini. I will not be showing it again. <laughs> it's a one-piece bikini, Twitch. That's not real. It's just a very progressive bikini. 
I see your utility pole and present this tree. <laughs> the, the, the fucking tree in the middle of the... <laughs> Honestly? Again, pretty cool, I think. That's not a bad tree. How do you get out? You go here. You park here or there. That's not bad. It's a big-ass driveway. The problem here is that that tree is gonna... Well, I guess it can't fall. It's too big. Bro, that shit is straight up. That tree is erect. It will never fall. Look at it. It's not even bending. Look at that. It can't fall. It's too big. Look at it. It's not gonna fall. I feel so safe with this tree. Just don't come home drunk. <laughs> I like this actually This is nice Somebody said there's a grumpy face in the middle of the tree I see it, that tree's mad Maybe this tree gives mystical wisdom <laughs> Maybe this tree will listen to you Through all your problems Right? Pocahontas ass tree, Mother Willow ass tree Don't call me a Disney <laughs> Because I knew the name I don't know how I knew the name I haven't seen that movie Welcome to Pound Town What? <laughs> okay, I think I think this house is owned by Randy and Martha Pound. That's not what it means. It's not what you think. This 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 house is owned by the Pound family. Surely. <laughs> it has to be. Why <laughs> Oh, 420,000 for 30. I got to move to Wisconsin. That's crazy. That's unbelievable, dude. 420k for 3600. God. What am I doing in Maryland? I'm going to go be a cheese head. <laughs> Hell yeah. And it's in Pound Town. Leave the sign. That's yeah, true. It isn't in like a Bioshock font. It's in a Bioshock font, but it's also in like under a Toontown font. That's very much like a Minnie Mouse font. <laughs> I don't know. So uh, it's, it's, it's kind of clashing, you know? Ooh. This is my ship. Like a mall with track lighting. Oh my god! This shit is... Uh, Wait, all the way? Oh my god, that's beautiful. Dude. This rules. This shit look like a Tony Hawk level? <laughs> you definitely, you definitely, if you ollie over this, it goes... <laughs> It actually does. This is amazing. Is it like on a bayou? New gap discovered. <laughs> this rules, actually. I love this. Wait, is it Illinois? Hold on. Is this it? How do you guys fight? Oh, shit. That shit looked like a Jurassic Park Institute. Bro, what? That shit looked like Mother Base. Black Mesa looking ass. Yo! How much? Two million. It's not that much. Not that much. A small price to play and pay for whatever the fuck this is. Dude! I gotta stream harder. <laughs> Welcome to my abode. <laughs> oh my god. When will it be my turn? Damn, they got a they got a TV showing a movie of the outside of your own house. Damn. Life actually is a movie. I live 30 minutes from here. Hook me up. Get me a discount. Please. Oh yeah, this shit's just a mall. Wait a minute. Where does where do furnishings go? the fuck is this? Is that a desk? Is this a desk? K 
kitchen? No. Bro, find one fridge. Find one fridge. Find one oven. <laughs> Wait a minute. Bro. You could do cooking shows there. <laughs> Hell yeah. It's real. I could do this. <laughs> In real life. Hell yeah. Host my own kitchen. Uh, their cooking show. Make seafood cake. <laughs> I don't know why I Parappa brain lately. I really do. Coney Parappa stream. I want to play Parappa so bad. For the 50 viewers that will show up. Honestly, I want to play Parappa 2 1v1 against somebody. I love that shit. That shit is so funny to me. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what the lights are about. They're probably mad expensive to fix, right? Like, if one of these, these track lights go out, you are in trouble, right? Surely. You have to, like, get a ladder. Yeah, that's hire someone money. Yeah, I don't know. I could have streamer money to... Do Dude, oh my, is that a pool? Wait a minute. <laughs> that shit goes into the woods. Is this just a creek? I don't know if this is a pool anymore. I don't think it's a pool. You don't go in there. That shit has bacteria. Your pool is inside. Yeah, your pool is inside. There's no way. I can't, how do I get out of here? There we go. <laughs> I tried to get back inside. It took forever. That's nice. I like this house. Went to view a house yesterday. Found this QR code on the back of a covered door. I got bloody Rick. Oh my god. Millennials, bro. Actual millennial homeowner. I got bloody Rick rolled. By the way, this is only six months ago. That's pretty funny. Is it? Is that pretty funny? Hmm. User who was born between the years of 1985 and 1998. <laughs> Is that funny to you? I need to drive past this house every time I visit with my parents. This is my nemesis. Oh, I love these. I love opening up like Pandora's box, right? Like when you go into these things that I have no idea what's inside. I love these. Gorgeous. Beautiful. Fantastic. Cartel money. Oh my god. This guy deals. Dude! <laughs> the Encanto house? I want it? How bad do you want it? You gotta gr- Oh, wait a minute. What? How did you find- Potomac, Maryland? Five mil. How do you find these that fast? Is that a pool? <laughs> I'm so stupid. This is not a pool. This is this is actually just a, a, a fountain, right? This pool is like a foot deep. <laughs> you gotta throw coins in that pool. This is gorgeous. Twitch, it's a statue. It's art. <laughs> I'm allowed to show it. Technically, that first one was art, too. Actually. So, you know. Twitch, don't be Philistines, you know? Is it Philistines or Philistines? I say Philistines because of No More Heroes, too. Yeah, gorgeous house. No jokes here. It's just pretty. Damn, look at that. I can't even tell what's happening here. Before and after zealous flippers dementored the soul out of a property. Ah! Fellas, how do we feel about... How do I even put this? Redesigns? I don't... What's the... There's a way to, like, white people 
to, to, to white to, to blame white people with this right remake lifeless now this is worse is it gentrify i didn't want to say that and get hans from chat it was literally on the tip of my lips but i was like i don't want to get hung <laughs> it's not i didn't think so chat you're so stupid it's not gentrify colonized the house was colonized. the house is worse the house is worse okay <laughs> it's exercised we'll do that this and not like like the gym Exercise like soul. Honestly, bro, I kind of like it. I'm gonna be a hundred dollars. I kind of, I kind of dig that shit. That shit's kind of nice. That shit looks like a new construction, right? White bread ass house. Hell yeah. I kind of like it. This shit looks like your sad aunt's house. Your aunt, who's in a loveless marriage and has two kids, and you're pretty sure one of them isn't from the dad, but they stay together anyway because he's an attorney and he makes a lot of money, and she's unhappy. But this house looked like, I don't know, New Beginnings! <laughs> right? This house screams New Beginnings! That shit smelled delicious. It's brand new. <laughs> Where'd the tree go? Oh, now I'm sad. Never mind. You're right. I missed the tree. You're going to run out of oxygen. You're right. You're right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm on team left house now. I'm team left house. So whether you eat or drink, whatever you do, do it all for the glory of God. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Wi-Fi. Eat my ass. Be okay. Did anyone else want to live in the Jumanji house as a kid? Now you can if you had 25 million. 25 million? Dollars? <laughs> oh my god. This shit just leaves. It's just what? Oh my god. I like this though. No, I don't. I don't like a red theater room. Paint that shit black. That joint hurt my eyes. I feel like I would get anxious. This is too many leaves. It's too much green, right? Don't you think... How is... How is Foff... How do you do that? How do you do that? It's in Orlando? Bro, you get to live here and you go to Disney. I gotta stream harder. Yeah, you're right. One day. <laughs> One day we'll get here. React Wars Season 35, going crazy. Heading to the kitchen for a snack at night. <laughs> Honestly, this rules. But it's probably dangerous. Yeah, drown. Yeah, <laughs> you will definitely perish. The I got a pee room. <laughs> Your ass would get no work done. You have to be retired to have this house. Because you would be peeing 24-7. My water drinking ass could not live in this house. I'll tell you that. I just hear that 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 water falling into the pool. And I'm like, oh god, I gotta go again. <laughs> My bladder would have to be empty at all times. I'd do it in the pool. It'd be a time save. Well, normally me too, but I'm not swimming all the time. You only pee in the pool when you go swimmies. It's not like I'm going to stand on the outside and pee in it like a psychopath. You have to, like, get in and then pee and then get out so nobody notices. <laughs> Me just alone getting in the pool to pee and then getting back. Why not? If you're going to pee in this pool, you might as well pee in the sink. Right? I feel like peeing in the sink would be more hygienic. Think about it. You don't think so? The sink at least has running water that will go down the drain. Peeing in this pool, it stays there. Think about it. Use your brain. I know I'm spitting. I'm right. Pool's got bleach, though. Doesn't matter. The sink goes down the sink. No, this is, this is, you pee in the sink in this house. This fireplace is giving me a conniption. What? Where does the, the smoke go? 
Does it go up and sideways? I guess. It, oh, uh, I, it didn't hit me. I feel like I was building up, up poison, like in souls, and then it hit me that it's not centered, and now I'm mad. <laughs> All right. Now I'm just like, ah, oh, God. I'm cursed. Yeah. Oh, shit. I finally caught it. Fellas! It is time to prime. 40 seconds until the ads pop. If you drop a prime or a tier one right now, you can avoid it. You got to do it fast, though. Really quick. You got to prime right now. You have to prime right now. I never say this. I never talk about this on stream. But it is time to prime. The ads are coming. Stop them before they arrive. It's only 20 seconds. Drop the primes this instant. Quick. And you'll get to be on the stream. Cor Corevi Zector. Thank you so much for the Prime. Danforo's giving it up. I love the gifties. QTheo99, thank you. You gotta do it fast, though. And I'll say your name. I never do that. It is better to come in the sink than to sink in the... <laughs> this is pretty good. Thank you, Typical Toad, for the resub as well. I don't think you were in any, any danger, but... All right, ads are starting soon. Hey, I tried to warn you. I tried to warn you, Primers. Best of luck. Thank you, Gidoy. Thank you, Ronan. All right, bless up. I'll see you guys soon. <laughs> World's wealthiest dog is selling Miami estate for 32. Are you kidding me? That's a dog house. I have to pay. This is one of my four free articles on Forbes so I can read a house about a dog. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I hate that dog. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck that dog. Gunther the sick. The dog has the sick. He's the sixth Gunther? What? How many belly rubs? He looks so smug. Nepotism ass dog. That dog didn't earn any of his wealth. So stupid. This is why I hate dogs. Goes to Versailles once. Okay. A nice home. Pretty good. Not bad. Thank you, lad, for Summit. Thanks for the Prime. Welcome back. What's inside? Uh, <laughs> A little weird. Thank you, Xenon Blues. It's a little weird. <laughs> it's one of my favorite usernames I've ever seen. All dogs are pigs. What is that? The Paw Patrol dog? Oh, I get it now. <laughs> I've never seen that name before. Somehow you've sent 375. I've just never seen it. That's a terrific name. I love your name. ADAP. <laughs> I love that. That's tremendous. Dude, I, I... So there's a furniture store near my house. How many have I sent? I'm not going to do this more than one. You can do this yourself, I think. A lot. There are 999 messages in this chatter profile. But there's room for one more. Ah. Huh? <laughs> There's a furniture place in my house that has these kind of things. And I'm always like, whose house could this work in, right? Like, I, and I don't think there's an answer. I don't think anybody's house could home these kind of furnitures, right? What are these TV angles? This shit will give you a, a bad neck. You better sleep on your left side only. <laughs> Or your right side and you just don't see it. Actually, my TV is kind of like this in my bedroom. Never mind. This person's based. I like this. This does give me like Dolly Parton house. Yeah, this does feel like Dolly Parton actually. I don't know why. It's the it's the, it's the the outside quaintness with the inner sophistication. Right? Something about that. That's nice. Yankee Candle Founders Mansion. This is all kitchen. I, bro, this is like a, a Dead by Daylight map. <laughs> you put some pallets in between these. 
Yeah. <laughs> this is a British Bake Off kitchen? Yeah, dude. They, uh, three more minutes. I have three more minutes. My torch will burn. <laughs> a kitchen archipelago. Yeah. Chased by Gordon Ramsay. I, I, this shit, I don't I don't know about this. Bro, if I was a Dead by Daylight killer, I would mi simply jump over the counter. I don't know why they don't do that. Why is de every Dead by Daylight killer is so immobile? Except for Legion, and that's why they're interesting. I hate that I know so much about Dead by Daylight. I hate that fucking game. I just think it's interesting, you know? I just think it's 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 cool how some of the characters are, are their lore, right? But I just fucking hate that game. Sorry to get stunlocked. I fucking hate Dead by Daylight so much. It's tag. It's tag. God, I hate that game. It's a game that is sad that it sucks. It really is. Why do you hate Dead by Daylight? Because it's tag. You're playing tag. The whole game is three stooges. You just run around a table. I did fucking... I... You're supposed to be scared, and it's all just fucking tag with a murderer and perks. It's so stupid. Damn, look at that. I should have invented Yankee Candle. Is this inside? What the fuck? This shit looked like the Kalahari Resort. I lost 100 viewers for talking about Dead by Daylight. Good riddance. Fuck those people. I hate Dead by Daylight. <laughs> I'll shout it from the rooftops. We don't want them anyway. <laughs> Dude, I what? I feel like the owner of Yankee Candle is probably Mr. Burns. I don't know why. I just get the feeling he's lonely. Do you think so? He's like sad and lonely and rich. The owner of a, of a candle empire. Maybe he has a, a happy, loving family, and I just don't. Harlan M. Kent. Surely he is a Wikipedia. No? Wait, did they say CEO or founder? Founder. Wait a minute. Founder is Michael Kittledge. Okay. Michael Kittridge. Is he happy? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> so, no. He's not happy. <laughs> not too happy. No. <laughs> Was he happy? Died at 67. Oh, well, here he is playing guitar. <laughs> He was playing guitar. He had some hobbies, I guess. Loved music and performed in bands. Damn, he was ecstatic. Is he survived by anyone? Surrounded by family and friends. Damn, he was happy as shit. <laughs> and who wouldn't be with this Great Wolf Lodge-ass house? <laughs> Not playing guitar anymore. El Bozo. <laughs> He's playing a harp up in heaven. Yeah. Bro at a tennis court? He was staying active too? <laughs> what the fuck? God damn. I want to found Yankee Candle. Need to make Coney Candle. Hell yeah. I'll be a candle billionaire too. Damn, we played through the whole Sims playlist. Loop it. What is the fragrance? <laughs> Don't ask me that. <gasps> oh, damn. That shit looked like the Kamehameha house. The, um, Kame house. Is that really what it's called? <laughs> Not the Kamehameha house? You know the one. The one Goku lives in. The Goku house. Kame house is correct. Okay, whatever. Damn, that's pretty. By the sea? Oh, that shit, one bedroom. D no plumbing. <laughs> I hope it doesn't snow. You gotta go outside to poop. Kame is turtle in Japanese. Wait, what? Really? Is this a turtle? 
Wait, then what's Kamehameha? Turtle, turtle house. <laughs> it all comes full circle. Small, small turtle house. It's turtle wave? Turtle destruction wave. <laughs> Why turtles? I remember being shocked when I found out that, like, everything in Dragon Ball is, like, broccoli, freezer, uh, cooler. I, I, I don't know. It's, it's, it's carrot. Yeah. I, what's going on there? Why vegetables? Why is he getting inspiration from food? Beerus is beers? Really? Gohan is rice, cabbage, Ginyu is milk. <laughs> is it just puns? That's so stupid. I hate that. Author was hungry. That's how he has to get inspired. He has to be hungry every time he writes. Piccolo is an instrument. Chi Chi is boobs? No way. Really? Chi Chi is milk. No, Genyu is milk. I think. Google Chi Chi boobs right now. Nice try, Twitch staff. You're not getting me on the thing earlier, and you're not getting me for that either. <laughs> nice try, Jeff Bezos. But I'm keeping my 3,676 subs. No, Cody's going bank giving. We're going bankrupt. He's taking all our money. Nice try. Drop a prime now to fight back against Jeffy B. <laughs> Go ahead, everybody. Drop a prime this instant. I only need one more to hit the goal. 3678. This is 77, you guys. <laughs> My 95.5 five split. I keep negotiating with Twitch. Coney, how about we get 50 cents and you get $4.50 of every sub? No deal. Coney, please. How do we keep the lights on? Amazon Web Services is expensive. That's your problem. I'm watching Watch Mojo. <laughs> oh my god. Close your eyes. I have to take a dump. Uh, why, why is the kitchen... Why is the shower more modest than the toilet? I guess you're full naked in the shower. You're only half naked on the toilet. I guess that makes sense. I like the futon here. In case you need company. Holding hands. I've had a dump like that before. I need some support. We've seen this one. Boring! What is that? What the fuck? This is like a, a brutalist Gaston. Yeah, this <laughs> brutalist is fu Yeah, this is this is like modern Gaston. Oh my god, Cash App Compound. I would definitely turn this into a gamer fortress. Y'all, what's good everybody? We're here at the Coinbase base of operations here in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. <laughs> Put a big like, I don't know, Liberty Mutual sign on the side. <laughs> Takis. Yo, what's good? One monitor in the whole place. Coney does look like an NFT guy. I would if you guys wouldn't harass me for it. I would love to sell an NFT, but you guys are like, oh, my ethics. Just don't buy it. I would send you, a, I, would, I would sell you a fucking NFT in a heartbeat. I'd be doing it for a month. And none of you would buy it, and I would make $8 million, and then I would get stream whatever I want. <laughs> Come on! And now the time has passed. NFTs aren't worth shit anymore. We missed the wave! Son of a bitch. We could have had grab bag forever. I could have sold... If I, I didn't even have to sell NFTs. I just had to try to sell NFTs. 
I could have had a Coney NFT that nobody bought and I make $8 million and then I could have just played fucking Pikmin 2! Son of a bitch. You guys blew it for me. Imagine, imagine going to the sink and you think this is a mirror and you're like, oh, I'm the Hulk now. <laughs> With words and everything. I would definitely smash that sink. Goosh. <laughs> Not again. Every day I wake up and I'm the Hulk. <laughs> it's pretty good. All right, I think we've seen enough houses. I think we're coming. Wait a minute. Halloween how Oh, it's only the inside. Or outside. Yo! Rock house! Damn, the rock is in several rooms? <laughs> that shit breaking through the wall? Wait a minute! <laughs> that shit is glitched. You yeah, build around the house. I love that. Honestly, that's cool. I don't know what you would do with it, but surely you could make, like, a fountain, right? And make, like, a little thing here and, like, run running water over the top of it or something. Forge mode? How do you clean that corner? Uh, I, oh. You, you have to get, like, one of those vacuums with a tube and you just throw that shit over. Like, you're repelling it. <laughs> throw it over. All right, I, I think of these houses, uh, I think I've made my choice... And I think now that I'm at 100k subs, I think it's time to move in to my preferred house, as you can see here. I'll see you all in Arizona. Thanks for watching, everybody. Remember to subscribe. Hey, if you subscribe, maybe we get another house at, I don't know, 200,000, 500,000, 1 million. I can't do it without you guys. Subscribe and like. I'll see you next time. Say bye, chat. We're all moving in together. We're all moving in. Go ahead and pack your stuff. We'll see you soon. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, I'll see you soon, YouTube. You guys can't come. You guys don't pay me for this content. It's free for you. You pay me by watching the Raid Shadow Legends ads. <laughs> you don't even watch them. I know you skip it. I know you're skipping the ads. It tells on you every time you do it. Uh, okay, honest question. When you guys skip ads on YouTube, do you feel bad? Do you feel like they know? I don't think you do, but I wonder. <laughs> No, 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 no. Yes! One yes. One guy feels really bad. Do not care. The first time, yes. I know, but I don't feel bad. Only if they come up with a really good skit. No, not at all. I use that block. One guilty. Okay. Just to let you guys know, we don't know if you skip, but we know if a lot of you skip. We do not care. Send it. Skip through. All right? If the ad is funny, then I'll stay. <laughs> you can skip all mine then. They're paying me to put the ad up, not to make it funny. <laughs> I'm reading shit. My ass is reading. I see you tear the fabric of reality and immediately skip. As soon as the green screen comes down, right arrow, right arrow, right arrow, right arrow. Or tap the screen a few times. I don't skip them if it's your video. You need the money. That doesn't help me. Non-sub? That doesn't help me! Non-subscriber? How dare you? There are better ways to help! <laughs> Come on! Did somebody say eco-footprint? Bro, I don't know why Ren keeps sponsoring, but I'll do it forever. I'm happy to help. Surely they're getting some value out of it. Clearly. Coney, I like the did someone say and then I skip. <laughs> as soon as did so. What if it was for you? What if the content that I'm going to do is something that you were interested in, though? Right? That could, that could be a big deal. I could change your life. Have you heard of Raycons? Hmm? But you feel pretty silly now. Hmm? All right. I said that last video was for me. This one's for me. <laughs> so somebody linked a... Uh, somebody linked a movie in here. Hold on. Somebody linked a movie in here in the, uh, in the Watch This Movie Discord. 
and it was five extremely low tier Mortal Kombat competitive characters, which I was like, oh, that's kind of cool. But then I saw this one instead, Mortal Kombat's Create a Fighter. And I was like, wait, I want to see that. Because whenever I see a Create a Fighter in a game, I'm like, how is that not broken? You could just make it busted. So I have to know. I have to see this creative fight. By the way, this is made by Ketchup and Mustard. Yes, that's their name. They are, I think, a twin uh, Mortal Kombat casting duo. Right? Something like that. Correct? Yeah. And they have a, a YouTube channel. They also play Rumbleverse, as every fighting game influencer does. Yup. It's true. Insane combo, yeah. I've seen one of these guys' movies a long time ago, but I but have to see the creative character thing. Teen games in general lend themselves a fair bit to creativity and expression. Teen games in general. Is that a real character? Is he fake? Necrid? Dude, he's so over designed. He has like an Iron Man. No, that's Kano. He has like a Kano chest thing. And a mask and a, a dinosaur head and a ball of energy? Link? Oh, do you guys not know about that? Oh my god, wait a minute. Do you guys not know about Link? That's crazy. Oh my god, it's a whole new generation. Hold on, I'm about to blow your mind. All right, so Link is in this game. Do you know who is in a different Soul Calibur game? <laughs> it's real. It's real. It's true. And the best part? Hold on. <laughs> Bro, the way he fights is ridiculous. Have you guys all seen the movie where where Yoda fights in Soul Calibur? In the fucking da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la. Bro, he still jumps around. <laughs> Look at how little he is. Da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la da 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 la. Da 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 da. Only low hits on Yoda. What is that dive? Nah, no, that's a baby fighting. That shit a toddler. How are you gonna hit a toddler? Yo! Get him, Yoda! This game looks bad. <laughs> Look at this channel. Pathetic game reporting. Wait, what happened to Yoda? Ring out. <laughs> Yoda, no! <laughs> Bro, where did Yoda go? Why did, he not, why did the floor stop there? They're on a bridge. <laughs> Yoda was going too hard. Bro, Yoda hates Darth Vader. Yoda hates that dude. Oh, fuck this guy. <laughs> Hold on, look at this without me here. It was feeling himself. Ring out. <laughs> Darth Vader stops moving. Ring out. Oh hell no. <laughs> Bro, Darth Vader just doesn't Battle move two. anymore. Fight. All right, hold on. Yoda's Yoda's ready on this one. All right, let's go, Yoda. <laughs> let's go. Let's get him, Yoda. Oh, that sweep is so bad. Oh, my God. Imagine getting swept kicked by this. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> that hitbox. Oh, my God. Bro, how did Va yeah Vader sold that like he died? Bro, Vader, how strong is Yoda's legs? Whoa! <laughs> K 
can't Yoda fly? This is an honest question. I don't I don't watch Star Wars. He has the force. No? He can telekinesis. Can he telekinesis himself? Right? He could jump really high. Okay. Damn, look at him go. Oh, he's spamming. And Yoda cheese it. Yoda, watch it. Yoda, you're very close to that edge. Watch out! Oh, he's being ass now. Yoda going a bit stupid. I got the glass breaking? Gotcha! Battle three. Fight. Wait. Battle three. The word three. for fight is lucha? I didn't know that. Like a luchador. Well, I thought I thought lucha was like flying. I thought it was more like a high flip. Like I didn't know that meant I didn't know lucha meant fight. Luchador is a fighter. Okay. Are we watching the whole best of seven? I think it'll be over soon. I think I've seen most of uh, Yoda's moveset. How does he kill Vader? Ooh, stabbed in the heart. Yup. He sat on Vader. It's like fanfic. Ooh! <laughs> Die. Good job, Yoda. The battle has finished. Anyway, I, I kind of got locked on this. Uh, Link in Soul Calibur. Um, cheats. He, I think he's good. He does, like, the smash down air thing where he can hop on your head. And I think it's good, or at least it... it I think it was cheap. Like, you could do that to your cousins, and they wouldn't know what to do. Like, if you play with friends, you know? He's not good, but he has one combo. Okay, so he's, like, he's cheesy. I don't know where... I'm trying to find the hot move. Is that Nemesis? Oh, the, <laughs> I thought that was like Resident Evil Nemesis. Okay, whatever. Anyway, Link was in this game, as was Spawn, as was... I don't know. A couple characters. Whatever. ...general lend themselves a fair bit to creativity and expression. Not just in the gameplay, hey, Hachi, but yeah, the visuals whatever. too. Many games allow you to make your own color palettes, maybe a costume for a character, or at the very least, will sport a ton of visual options to choose from. But sometimes, it doesn't end there. On a rare occasion, a fighting game will have a mode in place that lets the user create their own original character. Was it Soul Calibur, the new one, that had the big, like, the pride square? You know what I'm talking about? The Pride Cube. I think that was it. What? <laughs> oh, you don't know about the Cube of Pride? <laughs> uh, this was a fighter. I'm trying to find a video. But this is the cube. Oh yeah. yeah! There it is! There he is! Fight it! Fight it! These cubes! Fight it! <laughs> I want to see the whole match. I don't know. I don't know how you hit it. I don't know where the. Uh, I, I don't know where the hitboxes are supposed to be. But yeah, that shit was everywhere. The pride cube was all over Soul Calibur for a long time. <laughs> It's just a normal character hitbox. Yeah, but you can't see his hitboxes. Like, you don't know where he's swinging. Terrifying. Possibly the most standout example of this will yeah, do it, do it. Soul Calibur and its creative Cube. soul mode. As it is often the franchise most people think about with fighting game character Show creation. Show the Pride Cube, please. Not mentioning the years and years of wrestling games, of course, but <laughs> that really is a different kind of story, isn't it? Jack Black? The Quad G looks pretty good, during actually. During the golden age of PlayStation 2 and original Xbox, Mortal Kombat Armageddon had its own creator-fighter feature, 
where players can make their own fighter <sighs> from the ground up and even finely tune which specials and attacks that they have in a Hell match. Hell yeah. Pretty cool Thank for you, dump time it. an understatement. Thanks for the prime. Some... Just a friendly reminder, bears destroy gorillas. Mods! Thanks for the prime. No thanks for the message. Get that guy out of here. Get that guy out of here. This instant. The thing I relentlessly used as a kid. It was awesome. However, fast forward years and years where one often revisits these games with more of a competitive <laughs> mindset. Yes. Broken oh does not even begin to describe this mode when you're looking at the high level side of Armageddon. Custom characters running rampant in the online Bro, what's going on in the background of Mortal Kombat? Are those caskets? What the fuck is that? Armageddon. Cheese? Custom characters running rampant in the online netcode. Lava, in it's metal. Infinite, okay. unbreakable. Gotcha. Mats, <laughs> truly, some Jerick. abominations could be created that took an already broken Bro's game and made it even more so. On top <sighs> of some little tips and tricks that you can do within the creator <laughs> to have moves that. What kind of move of is some that? Little tips and tricks. That what is he doing here? What is Jarek doing? What is Jarek's weapon? It's like a sword with a Tricks rope that you can do like with the creator to have moves that <laughs> actually you actually shouldn't have. You want to join me for today's video because things are going to get really weird. They better oh, die. So, let's start off by running through what creator fighter is here. Oh damn, you can just make Cyrax. On the visual side, you have all of the basic information first, then you can change the visuals as you see fit. Okay. You have a decent amount of options, but can't go into insane detail. The color options are cool, as there's a fair few of them, and Dude, you can have neat, some extra actually. bits and bobs. Damn, this guy's loaded! Look at him, coins! He could buy the houses we saw earlier. 33 million coins, with a K. Damn, dude. If you want them. You can make some cool-looking characters, but they won't have the same level of detail that the main roster will have. When it comes to moves, though, this cool is where man. it becomes the most interesting. You can name, choose the stance of both weapon and your hand-to-hand, -hand, on top of the weapon letting you choose between sword style yeah, or axe moving. style. With the actual weapons themselves looking pretty different in style, axe will be the name, but you can use a club, hammer, machete. You get the idea. Okay. In a lot of cases, these weapons belong to existing characters, but you can give them to yourself too. Being able to choose the moves is where the creator fighter becomes as broken what? as it is. Dude, what if you can make a Smash character? Oh my god. Thank you, Burger. Thanks for the prime. They wouldn't help him IRL at all, but you can hear it in Coney's voice how bad he wants those coins. I am covetous. You're right. I'm covetous. I would never play this game, Mortal Kombat Armageddon. But I want so badly to have a save file with that many coins in case I ever did. I gotta get those coins. <laughs> uh, I'm just fucking... I'm, I'm the dragon from The Hobbit. What's his name? Greedo. I'm Greedo. I just want all the money. <laughs> Please, so, give honestly, me the coins. the easiest way is to list all of the reasons and tick them off one by one. Yeah, I recorded Greedo. a bunch of various <laughs> custom characters that I made for this video to show all of the necessary What's examples. What's Carnival so, Spin? Let's go. Fundamentally, there's a bunch of key moves in this game that characters have that make them quite powerful. Now, those moves will vary, but with the custom fight... Wait, who is Tremor? Is Tremor like Earth? Sub-Zero? That's so stupid. Fighting styles that you have in the game, That's, most of those moves are equipable zero. for your custom character. He's the dirt ninja. This means that if you have an eye <laughs> for what moves are so strong... Wait, but he has fire! Wait this a minute! That if you have That's an not eye dirt! What... Wait, he's scorpion! What the fuck? Lava. Oh, shut the fuck up. You can't do that! You can't... Moves are... the, okay, he's custom. Okay, never mind. Never mind, okay. That's flint and steel? <laughs> That's so stupid. You can't do that. ...are so strong, you can equip them and use them in any order that you Ooh. want. I guess the first thing to cover is the idea of free throws, which is something that MKD and MKA I didn't know that you could customize have. existing Land characters. a move with enough hit stun and recovery, 
and the opponent will be stuck in place, where a meaty throw is Ooh. completely guaranteed. Reason being is because you can't tech throws in these games, and they're unblockable. Ooh. Most characters that get this will get some bonus damage, but with Creator Fighter, you can actually equip a throw that launches and sets up for a- Devora is in this? Oh, that's a- that's a- that's a custom, right? I was gonna say, Devora was later. Okay, Combo. Never mind. The immediate applications are ridiculous here. Where are Because her you bugs? can do much larger combos than the base roster can, and that's not even accounting for the crazy broken stuff that you can do with a few little tricks in mind that I'll cover in a bit. Why does that bounce Free off the ground stuff that so you hard? Do with a few little tricks Why is there a weak spot? Mind that oh! I'll cover <laughs> You hit them in the knee Pretty and they bit. just... Free throws on Creator Fighter is absolutely ridiculous. Now, outside of even combos, MKA has busted single <laughs> hit buttons that if you know what to look for, what can be all yours. I think move? one of the standout examples here is MoCap's infamously strong low poke that deals 13% damage, likely because it was given uppercut damage incorrectly. The deals 13%? standout examples here is... Mocap's infamously strong low poke that What is that? Dude, this move? Watch the health bar. Ready? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. A low poke doing 13. Ow! He hits you in the fucking liver. Ow, dude! Ow! Dude, uh, uh, this, this wind move is killing me. Kills. How many frames do you have to react? Now, outside of even... All right, here we go. Here comes the wind move. All right, here we go. Wait. Wait. Okay. We're turning. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, kind of more than I thought. Maybe like 13. Not too bad, actually. The problem Ridiculous. is how fast it is. Now, outside that of shit even moves. combos, All right, you can react. has busted ah, it just moves quick as hell. Got single okay. hit buttons that it if just, you know what to look yeah. for, can be all yours. But you can look at the I animation. Think one of the okay. standout examples here. Blockable, though. As long as it's blockable, we're good. Is MoCap's infamously strong low poke that deals 13% <laughs> damage. Low poke is likely me. because it was given uppercut damage Wait, in low poke. Well, I thought you couldn't tech throws. How he tech in the middle of the throw? Watch this. 13% damage. Stop. Because <laughs> what is going on in Mortal Kombat? Why did he stop the throw animation? That's a combo breaker. Can Is that like a burst? Like Because uh, it was given. That's in this game? Okay. Uppercut damage incorrectly. That low poke exists in Creative Fighter. Here it comes, here it comes. And Do the low poke. still does 13% damage on hits. Boom! Needless to say, there's no reason you wouldn't take this button. Look for the perfect buttons that fit the meta of Armageddon to make your character Bones? even more busted, even in the general neutral. Maybe they give a mix-up. Maybe a they'll give a free hand. throw, as we discussed earlier. Go for absolute safety above all else, because safe moves are a luxury in this game. Basically, go nuts. Right, it's time to talk about... Is that... Wait, I don't know which one, one of, of these the first... is created. I don't know which one of these is fake. I assume it's this guy's because it says, I don't know, LMAO, and he looks like Bizarro or Brainiac or whatever. But this guy definitely doesn't look real either. Like, I, I probably this guy, but... Uh, yeah, he's wearing, like, a sergeant hat? Uh... Just exploits that you can use to make your character <laughs> even better. Why when did every character your... have, like, this thing on their chest like an Iron Man, you know? Special moves. You have a decent amount of them, but not every single attack in the game. However, with a bug, you can give yourself more utility than you should have because, you know, it's Armageddon. Why not? The one air special you can equip <laughs> is a dive kick. This move is done by pressing down three in the air, no. and it's mega simple. However, here's what's weird. If you choose any of the other specials in this category, and then you go back into the move selector, hover over dive kick, but press two to cancel the menu, your chosen special will now have the input of down three and the air only property. 
This results in hilarious looking moves. Not all of them work in the air anyway, but most will simply be an airborne version that covers more space, looks, gives more combo options, I guess, whatever. Bad. We'll be oh, returning to this wait, in a bit because okay. it is a key element of Show making me. characters so broken. There is a ton of utility here. Bro, did he die? Did he? Did he die? <laughs> wait a minute. Bro, look at his health, though. He had so much health. How did he die? What? That's not a fatality. What? Keeping in line with the bugs that you can use to expand your move list, ring this out. one oh, okay. is arguably gotcha. the most important. Oh, that's kind of cool. I didn't know they ring when out. putting a string together, if you take Hold a Hold on, I gotta go back, back and look at that animation. That kick in animation? This category, Flying and then you kicks. Go back into the move selector. Any special you could. Because, you know, it's <laughs> Armageddon. Why not? Who says Mortal Kombat the animations aren't nice? One air special. Whoa! You can with. It's kind of like Luke Kang kick, but he's you know, got the rotation. Armageddon. On it. Why not? Look at the rotations. The on one this. air special you can equip. What an athlete! Is a dive kick. This move is. <laughs> oh my god! The air only. Well, he... This is amazing. Keeping I love in this. line with the bugs that you can use to expand your move list, this one is arguably the most important of them all. When putting a string together, if you take a move and the string has more hits to go, you will be unable to use that move in future hits. Essentially, if your standing one is, let's say, Ninja Strikes, a button okay, that belongs to say. Cyrax, the 1-1 one, one, and the 1-1-2 one, one, will be unable to have Ninja Strikes as it's already been equipped. Okay. However, you if could, you construct you the string in that. the reverse order, you can, for the most part, take any move that you wish in any order allowing you to use the same attack more than once in a combo string. Uh -huh. The effects of this are severe, because if you end a string with a move that has good juggle properties and fast recovery, you can stack up two fast and far-reaching punches beforehand, which gives you easily the most simple infinites any character can perform. <laughs> Must have used Dunn? this with his custom character last oh year God. to showcase just how broken a character oh can be. God. This and shit look like Tekken. John style. This is literally just Tekken. John style? His, fi his fighting style is named after him. John style is just bouncing you on his fist. Oh you can use God. this in any way you want to make some hilarious looking combos or regular three I want to watch strings. this game. You can have some real fun with it, but uh, the purpose of this video is to show off how broken it is. I love so, this. Infinite Bro, look at that low it, hit! Hilarious looking look at combos his damage! Or regular three hit strings. You can have some real fun with oh. it, but the purpose of this oh. video is to show off how broken oh it is. So, God. infinites all day. If you can double up buttons that work for infinite combos and giving a free throw grounded, it's Who's even Mavado? better. Is he Cyrax's real? Ninja Strikes he is looks like a magician. the best punch to end a string with for this reason. Giant combos are obviously Shujinko. ridiculous, but you... I really feel... I, I, you literally could... I wouldn't believe you if you said these characters were real. These are ridiculous. Get given three breakers every match. So there are some ways to get around them. Shoot, until you've run out of Blaze? Anyway. You were kidding. But what if we wanted to bypass Just a fu that? That's a killer instinct guy. The way I did just that was Who to take inspiration that? from Ermac and Jarek, as their weapon stances are identical. He's like a ghoul from Fallout with boxing Ermac's gloves and a club. Weapon down two launcher, which can't be broken for some reason. Both of these characters can use their unbreakable weapon down two to get more unbreakable damage. Okay, Carrot how do you defend launcher, this? Which this is a mid-range... Both of these... Gra can you block this? You can block this? Can you you can block him um, grabbing you. Like this. Unbreakable weapon... Huh. Open down two to get more unbreakable damage. Right. For Ermac, Thank it's down Thank to you, into lift. Really. And for Jarek, it's down to Jarek, I love Jarek. All of that is Big unbreakable. Fan. But with the creator fighter, you can do the exact same thing, but give yourself other unbreakable moves to get the same effect. Like what? I used the axe style. I gave myself the down two, which can't be broken. And I combined Fujin's unbreakable wind lift and his unbreakable wind charge. 
but I used the air version of the charge via the bug that I mentioned earlier in this video. <laughs> You end up with the exact same effect, about 40% or so unbreakable damage in a lot of cases. But if you use the reverse string creation exploit to give He's yourself the three punch that string that Jarek and Ermac have, you actually get a free throw and the ability to continue oh juggles God. really well. You're not supposed to be able to make this string, but building it in reverse what juggles is he kicking? really well. You're not supposed to be able to- like kicking Doritos to make this string but building it in reverse you can loop the same punch that's nice. three times that's nice. in a row so let's say you a caltrop the... oh shit three dude caltrops are brutal why don't we still use those those are like ancient technology but that shit's still painful three hit into caltrops are crazy throw, which launches then you can do down two unbreakable wind lift unbreakable <laughs> air the wind box charge gloves. the only chance not even box here is the first few hits he's wearing otherwise sandals. you can't do anything <laughs> If they're out of breakers in these connects, that well, shit is just you giant jack. True, actually. Hand. Oh hell yeah! <laughs> Yo! Does he fight with Pepsi? Surely there's a Pepsi move. On a casual level, Creator Fighter was really fun. Yes. Most of us could make it seems custom delightful. characters. It seems maybe tremendous. Maybe a variation I would of an kill existing for character or something. The usual stuff, I guess, when people have this kind of tool at their disposal. But if you wanted to be annoying with it, you could craft the perfect <laughs> character that would doing? take even the strongest characters in the base roster and give them a run for their money, which, trust me, in <laughs> Armageddon is saying a lot. You could use custom creations online, <laughs> so that was hammer. obviously a headache in itself. How much? <laughs> I just noticed the refreshment. The terrible netcode affected that style. is always up in the air, as old GameSpy servers were not the greatest for these games. But the point remains that online? many who played the online era of PS2 have often said to me that this was something you encountered quite often. This so game was online? Now, I've merely scratched the surface in today's video because this game has so much broken tech. Do you guys remember when Smash 4 wouldn't let you play as a me online because you might run into Hitler? And then Ultimate was like, ah, it's fine. <laughs> Who cares? They turned it back on? That's so weird. Why did they do that? I don't know why they did that. Fuck it. Hitler is here now. <laughs> They did say everyone is here. I meant everyone, I guess. Even a guy with a dick on his nose. Everyone is here, yeah. I, I don't know. That's weird. I don't know why they did that. That you can take from the base roster and apply it to your own creation in even more busted ways. But the characters that I've made today showcase a lot of the tech from characters that I already know how to use. Ooh. There's got to be tons Boom. more to be found and exploited. And that really is what Creator Fighter is all about if you play it in 2022 using emulation or something. Thank you Emu so much what? for watching this video. I appreciate your time as always. And Bro, I wanted well, to see more goofy shit. Holy crap, that noob cybot history video seemed to blow up. So if anyone on this channel I wanted is to see more dumb that, shit. Welcome and enjoy a ton more Mortal Kombat to come. I wanted to see more dumb shit. Whatever, I'll subscribe anyway. I'll give it up. Damn, his noob cybot video did pop off. 714k. Let's go. Jeez. Not bad. Pretty good. What's this? Pyromancer Tanya 32% dim. Wait, this is old. This is a new game, though. What are these animations? You know, I'm someone who defends Mortal Kombat animations. I don't think they're that bad. But oh my god. What is that turnaround? Come here! <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, the Terminator one is the one that everybody knows. So wait, her throw's doing 32? Okay, that's normal. Okay, you put the thing on her. Jeez! Uh, well, maybe that's a debuff. That's debuff juice. Yeah, whatever this is. Not a bug. You put the debuff juice on, take more damage. Boom, boom. 
That's not how that works. <laughs> sure? She took more damage than that too, right? Hit the hit the throw. Oh, never mind. Debuff juice for all. See? That's what it is. Has there ever been a fighting game character with a no cell gimmick? Shao Kahn, I think. If you hit Shao Kahn with a lot, he doesn't move. That's why everybody jump kicks against him, I think. That's literally just super awesome. And then he says, you suck. Let's play God of War. I didn't want to do that. I wind up in this guy's stream. I'm the one viewer? What the fuck? How did I get roped into this? Bro, why did YouTube... Hey, check this guy out! And then he just immediately threw me into his mood. What? Now I feel awkward. He's gonna say, hi, Coney. <laughs> Does he see me? Oh, because he's lying. <laughs> what the fuck? I can't leave now. Is he the only guy in the Mortal Kombat X category? Damn, there's a lot of people in. Well, maybe 11. Okay. Damn. Five low-tier characters? Eh. What the fuck is this? Hey, what's going on? Mortal Kombat theme, take Wh on... And if you, like, get hit in a certain radius... Mortal Kombat uh, had a cart will, game? Like, hit you. Scorpion, you know, spears people. He just speared me right there. He spears you, and you, like, ricochet and boomerang all the way to, like, the back of him. Uh, Raiden does, like, thunder type of earthquake around his carts. Some zero force freezes the characters. This shit looks like them. Crash uh, Team Jax Racing. Like it looks pound. pretty good. Um, oop, there you go. Burned in lava. Die! <laughs> uh, Jax does earthquake pound, yeah. Um, oh my god! Joe throws up on you. Yeah, he, like, turns around. The it also had around. chess. What? Around, and, uh, yeah, he just vomits. I'm not sure Katana believe it do. Don't think I've ever used them. Baraka throws like his uh, projectile. So that's that's a red dead. All oh, the special moves, that was that was close. Okay. Oh, this is bad. Third place. Third place. I didn't know this existed. <laughs> no. Did I get fourth instead? The last set. Kano cart? <laughs> I knew about puzzle combat and I knew about chess. I have seen chess before. I have seen the chess one. Uh oh, I forgot to say. Ads! Ads, 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 ads. drop prime now, drop a prime now, drop a prime now, quick, 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 quick prime. Oh, you missed it. I forgot. I forgot to say it. That's tough. Whoopsie daisy. Oopsie poopsie. Whoopsie doodle. Uh oh. I made a whoopsie. My bad. Thank you, Philip Blevin. Hey, the ads keep the channel moving. It's nice. Hold on. Wait. 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 I had a movie I wanted to watch. I can't find it now. Wait. I had one. What movie? I don't know. It was in my uh, watch later. I don't remember the name of it, though. Darman Christmas Special. No! It's not the Darman Christmas Special. This one? What is this? Oh, this one's fucked up. This one makes me feel sad to watch. Have you guys seen this? Do you guys know this one? This one's sad. The score always does this shit. <laughs> Perfect three legend. I I don't know, man. How do you come? How do you come back from this? <laughs> it's thirteen minutes long. Did they know? Surely they do. I didn't even think about that. That's true, actually. That's a good point. Ah, uh, okay. Real quick. In fighting games... Uh, oh, it's one of these? Legacy means a lot. 
It's something that okay. can be defined by an in, in case you guys don't know this story. Incredible play. Okay. The full match is or 44 minutes. Wait, really? The whole thing? It takes on a life of its own. Dude, it's weird to me. Or It's weird to me that this is still, like, so... Like, yeah, it's a big deal. But, like, I don't know. This happened, like, 20 years ago, right? Is it still that crazy? That clip got me into esports. I guess it is. No, you're right. <laughs> no, you're right. It's a good clip. You're right. You're right. You're right. Unironically, watching uh, Yipes videos with my friends in high school got me hype as fuck. And that got me into Smash. So I get it. I thought he was funny as hell. <laughs> Or even through a Coney stream idea marathon until he hits the parry. <laughs> it can't be that hard, right? It's just timing. It do 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 do. It's probably harder. It's not that hard. It's probably hard to do in tournament with nerves, right? Rivalry that takes on a life of its own. I'm you already failed it. No, I didn't. Do, do, oh do, my do, god! Do, do. I can't. There's probably. Is there something online that lets you do it? Like, like, try the Daigo parry, or the, um, yeah, do the Daigo parry, like, online. If that doesn't exist, it should. There is? Yeah, like the Sans fight. Yeah, 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 where is it? On the PS3 game. No, I mean, like, a web game. It! It it! You it know what I mean. It cemented by a famous victory. He's done it! He's done it! Yeah, for the impossible consequences of being that you know bracket. what I mean. Or it can be immortalized by an infamous defeat. But the best part of this clip is that guy. <laughs> He's so triumphant. I did it. <laughs> I'm the champion. But no matter the game, leaving your mark on its competitive history is something every player dreams of. It's a surefire way to gain recognition and respect from both opponents and fans alike. Fighting game is something so great. However, for a three-time EVO winner like Carl Perfect Legend White, getting recognized isn't the problem. You want EVO it's three times? Respect. I didn't know that. Because Damn. back in 2015, Perfect Legend's old-school trash talk invoked the wrath of a rising star that refused to give him any. Bro, I, I genuinely feel so a bad. Like, imagine... I, I don't... <laughs> like, of course you would shit talk... A new player, right? Well, of course you would shit talk the new guy. How are you supposed to know the new guy was fucking Sonic Fox, right? How are you supposed to know it was them? Right? Like, I, I, I don't know. You're just, you don't know it's Superman. You're fucking with Clark Kent, and then he just fucking stomps. I don't know, Rising man. Rising star that refused to give him it's any. so sad. This is bad. This is bad. Teabag Oh! And what started as a small online feud between two Mortal Kombat New guy greats, ends up being LeBron. Yeah, like they, they, uh, they were pretty good, but they end up being like the GOAT, right? How the fuck are you going to... become something far Man. bigger. There's not a day that goes by that I don't hear about it. So how did Twitter <laughs> beef turn into a widely so recognized sad. meme? And how in the hell did Perfect Legend get 13 0 uh... in a first to 10? Why would you ever you take the extra out. three? Even if you win... If you don't 3 0, it still looks bad. Oh, you should done. just go home, bro. I'm not gonna come out of this looking good. <laughs> oh, man. All right. So, if you're unfamiliar with the blood and guts underworld of Mortal Kombat esports, let me introduce you to the man, the myth, and the meme that is Perfect Legend. The He's only people I know in Mortal Kombat are Sonic Fox and Tweety.
And I guess Perfect Legends, but I don't know if he counts anymore. OG fighting game player from Toledo, Ohio, known for showcasing some flashy Ooh. moves in game Ooh. and out. <laughs> but it was back in 2006 that Perfect Legends really introduced himself. Bro, this as old a Evo style is so hot. Look at this. This is so nice. With the moving PNGs. That Perfect I Legend love that. Really introduced himself as a force to be reckoned with. When he does, Sonic Fox just play everything. He plays uh, not everything. He plays like Skullgirls, or Day. They play everything. Uh, they play Skullgirls, DBFZ, uh, all the NRS stuff. They tried to play Smash. <laughs> Didn't work out. It was a little bit too hard. <laughs> he won his first. Evo Smash is kind of hard. Dead Smash is kind of hard. <laughs> Has any fighting game player gone into Smash and done well? The opposite has happened. Apology, man. Not long after that, I guess, Perfect yeah. Legends shifted his attention to Mortal Kombat, cementing himself as one of the best in the scene by claiming back-to-back -back Evo titles in 2011 and 2012. And here you go, C Junior, with another opportunity. Legend, Bro, I forgot about there. VVP. Be oh a huge my god. Right here. No. no. Oh, that wow. would have been it. This is it. Perfect Legend takes it. He's your Evo 2012 MVP. Grand Champion. But for as long as Perfect Legend has been recognized as a top player, he's also developed a reputation over the years for speaking his mind, whether it's about the game or his opponents. I grew up in the Jordan era, right? Where everyone talked trash and they're over competitive. Like, that, that's, that's where I grew up in. And that's that's me. I'm just competitive. I would say that I'm blunt. I'm not going to lie to Zuko anyone. was a Marvel player. Be, I love Zuko, I'm going to tell man. you just how it is. I but love since that Since 2015, Perfect Legends name hasn't been tied primarily this to any This cam of is too close to me. I don't know what it is. I hate close Instead, cams. Instead, it's become synonymous Something about with that a just, fateful I, match that has ascended into, well, legend. You see, Perfect Legend's troubles began on Twitter when he drew the attention of Dominique Sonic Fox McLean, a fighting game prodigy that burst onto the scene in 2014, capturing two Evo titles before the age of 18. Anything will do it. Pull your dragon tattoos out there. Glowing. That game is bright. What the fuck? Anything will Dude, I can't see the game. Is this normal? Or is this like a capture issue? Look at this. Pull your <laughs> oh my god. Look at this bloom. That's normal? It looks awful. Terrible. Oh, Caltrops. Second Caltrops match in this stream. Wow. I think we can put to rest. He's the, he's the best. Anyway, the beef between the two Evo champions was the era sparked of after Brown bloom. NetherRealm's yeah, yeah. community like manager shit, tweeted yeah. that you could use any character to win in MK, a position that Perfect Legend didn't exactly agree with. And what they did is they used Sonic to cite their source of you can win with whoever. And I was like, Sonic won with Katana, but Katana got like maybe a laundry list of buffs before that event. Oh no. And Sonic caught wind of the conversation uh, and I guess initially began to think that I was trying to discredit. So then we started talking trash yeah. and things escalated. Now, Perfect Legends How bad was it though? may not have been targeted at Sonic. What? Fox, but it was on. Both players agree this is, to play Dude, this is just like the Leffen Snake Salem thing. It's literally the same thing. Match at That's Summer Jam crazy. 9 to settle. PL revisionist history. He was absolutely talking shit. Uh, it's just like the Leffen Salem. And the event began uh, to generate some serious buzz. It's now, just like the you face like the another player thing. in a tournament setting, you typically play a short set involving a maximum of three or five games. But the first to Wait. ten short set involving a maximum of three or five games. No. But the first I thought I knew that guy. First to ten is a fighting game tradition that changes that. You know, first to tens, one of the Wait, that is hit? A fighting game tradition that changes. What? Why that shit looks late. Does is there like a is that EX or something? What it has a projectile. What? Oh, V trigger. Okay. There's a fucking projectile on the the flash kick. Okay. You know, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Okay. It's special. Like first and tens are Street of, Fighter Five is know, fucked up. I didn't know. In, super important is because My it bad. gives people a chance to adjust, and it makes sure that people feel like it's more accurate in terms of who's a better player. 
as Sonic Fox arrived for the match, they promised a Kyle's an asshole. and easy money for those who had side bets riding on the flashy Furries win. And even though the original challenge on Twitter was about Aaron Black versus Kung Lao, uh, Sonic Fox was allowed to set the terms. So they picked Kitana, uh, a bad matchup for Perfect Legends Kung Lao. Although I think Sonic Fox is a heavy favorite, I definitely want PL to win because you know, love him or hate him, and PL talks, people listen. But she's about Mortal Kombat. Right. They definitely listen. Now, the first round seemed to promise a very close set. Okay, all right. All right, Perfect Legend looking good. Wait, so he's using oh, Katana, which man. is good Wait, against Kung Lao. Bro, this doesn't mean forward. anything. He picked a good matchup. He gets the chip kill. Okay, so that was Whatever. a pretty close first round. That was very important to establish on both sides. But after a few rounds and some oh, absolute... Oh, bad matchup. Oh, I got mixed up with the way she said. She's bad against Kung Lao. Okay, got you, got you. Okay. Really brutal Other Katana one. combos from Sonic Fox. Things were starting to look pretty bad for Perfect Legend. Oh, my God. And all unbreakable right now. All unbreakable. Stop. Stop. Bro, what? 40%, almost 40% unbreakable. He jumped back once. Uh. uh <laughs> 40%? And they were about to get much worse. Jesus Christ. Again. <laughs> Ooh, the stutter. <laughs> the Does that wake up? Again. Again. He did the... <laughs> Dude, Mortal Kombat is so we're stupid. About to get look at this. Look at this worse. wake up spin. Jesus look how fast Christ. this Again. is. Again. Ah! <laughs> Ooh, the stutter, the shimmy. Oh, wake up, said, 360. Oh, up, this, uh, is bad. this is bad. This is really bad. Tea bagging. Oh! oh my god. Tea bagging. Uh. <laughs> Obviously, we. <laughs> he, he froze. We, he doesn't move. Oh. Tea uh. How the hell do you react to that? I think you just hold back. I I played a bunch of. Mortal Kombat, I just held back most of the time. Or no, Block isn't holding back. Block is holding a button. So you just hold the button. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why it's different. Because like in Mortal Kombat, you could just hold Block without giving up space. I think that's the idea. So it's like okay to have less reactable stuff, I think. It's weird. Obviously, when you have somebody figured out like that, like, you know, at one point, it gets kind of into a pattern. And you kind of see I don't understand fighting game again. balance. And fighting games are about pattern recognition. It's about mickups. Yeah, because like... If you if you if you didn't have a block button, Scorpion would be annoying as fuck, because Scorpion teleports behind you. <laughs> so like at, at a certain point, I was like, oh snap! Like this might be, this might be like ten. Shut up! Minutes. I got the like, mix. Like, halfway through. <laughs> yeah, we gotta watch oh, this. Oh my god! Yeah, we gotta watch this. Finally, after finding himself down nine games, like an injustice, bro. Was it a fuck injustice one? I don't even remember what character had it, but I remember one of them being an asshole. Was it Aquaman or Green Lantern? I don't remember. I was a Grundy player, so I, I was miserable. I played it. Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> Superman, was that it with the mix-ups? I don't know. I played Grundy. I remember Lancer and Aquaman being bullshit. And my friend from played Joker, who was bad, but he had a gun, so it still pissed me off. It looked like Perfect Legend might rally back, but that hope disappeared very quickly. Oh Aquaman was broken in two. Not one. I thought it was this his respect. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed the match. Aquaman uh, might have been I don't a think it lived up to the hype. In both, but I think okay. we may have learned something here. Uh, I'm sure did, that Sonic Fox is gonna make some kind of pop off. It did, doesn't really matter. Did, did we really learn anything? But that wasn't the end of it. <laughs> didn't no. really Sonic learn Fox anything. wasn't satisfied with just a decisive victory. Uh, they wanted to rub salt into Perfect Legends wounds. You're really good with Ping Lao. But I can name two that are better with each variation, which I said before with DJT. Oh no. And you're, gonna, you're gonna pop off and you're gonna shut up and Sonic Fox. And you had to right. run your mouth no. on Twitter saying, You were oh, me. God. And I told you, I told you! Oh my I would God. Turn all this shit out of you. Dude, I, I can't even imagine, like, losing 0 10 and then having to stand there. Right? Like, you have to double down. You have to talk more shit. You have to just make shit up. Honestly, it's the only way you can do it. Just make shit up and be funny. Like, you gotta do low-tier God, like, just, just cut a promo and be funny, and it's okay. My B? That's uh, not... No. Or just don't talk shit to begin with. Well, <laughs> yeah, there's no reason to do the first part. Yeah. Yeah. You're a three-time champion. Now this new kid is saying there's four people who play your main better. Yeah. I mean, like, new games can be brutal, right? Maybe he, like, you know, four-time champion, but, like, in different games. Well, I guess it was in this game. I don't know. 
I would take the L. I, that's why you're different. I wouldn't. I couldn't. You should have done that shit when you were young. I mean, there, I did a lot of shit talking when I was young. Like, when I was when I played Brawl. I did a lot of shit talking, but it's like, we didn't have the stage to do this. I won a bunch of money matches against people. I lost a bunch of money matches, but I never lost, like, 05 or 150, <laughs> let alone 10 right? That's different. Coney was smart enough to shit talk on forums that didn't. I shit talked in person more. Dude, the brawl days were the Wild West. People were were ruthless. People were mean. But I don't really had. I didn't really have that much beef with people. Not people that are still around anyway, or people that you guys would know. Did I not wow. have any? The only person uh, who salvages is KBR when he beat F Champ at bracket. Yeah, dude. Yeah. So so uh, came Blue River. Lost to F Champ, and F Champ made like a big spectacle about it and was talking shit. It was, I think, Marvel 3. And it was like an exhibition, like a money match or uh, whatever. And then KBR won the next day in bracket, which is fucked up. <laughs> Anyone else would have probably <laughs> swallowed their pride, taken the L, and gotten the hell That's out of the crazy. building as fast as they possibly could. But Perfect Legend In grand like finals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot about that part. Instead, he uh, decided to make things infinitely worse. All right, first off, Sonic Fox, I want you to let you know, like I've had many times since I've talked to you, uh -huh. you are fucking godlike. Don't do that. Don't do that. You can't do that. I hate it when they do that. I hate it when they're like, yeah, you're very talented and you are my friend. Don't show respect. Now's not the time to do it. I've been saying that to you forever. <laughs> I'm not doing it. <laughs> I have never, I, I have never, ever, ever, but. ever said he was a bad player. I never said he sucked. Uh, I said his fundamentals were bad. This <laughs> is like, dude, this is haunting. It's like sinister, with the projector playing. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> this is terrifying. Hold on. <laughs> look at this. I did. Just look at this. I Jordan Peele movie vibes. This is haunting. Like they're playing a video of his death on top of him. Have you guys ever seen Sinister? It's so scary. It's so scary. I'm done. <laughs> Man, I, I, I have never, ever, ever, ever <laughs> said he was a bad player. I never said he sucked. Uh, I said his fundamentals were bad. I didn't say that. Oh, come on, PL. You should walk away now. Man, might be true. Sure. I remember when this happened live. I was commentating a different event. We gave up to watch this. <laughs> Have you ever, Say Jim? You're here. Uh, by the way, everybody say hi, Say Jim. Say Jim, be honest. Have you ever like been casting a match and then there's another match going on over there and you're just like, that's happened to me at Evo, <laughs> all the time. Yeah, I'm, like, casting, like, I don't know, top 64 of Ultimate, and I see, like, AMSA versus HBox over there, and I'm like, oh, he's got to really pull it together. Oh, we're on last stock. Anything could happen. My eyes, I, my ass is not watching. My ass is not looking. You willingly watch an HBox match? Hold on, this is an HBox safe speech. This is, I'm 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 H fam. What are you talking about? I love Jigglypuff. What are you talking about? I'm a Puff player. Less buttons, more wins. Go home, bro. Hell yeah. You're dude. not gonna come out of this yeah. looking good. Huh? <laughs> Why the hell am I commentating Quandale versus Jake? Exactly. I should just be playing fucking melee. A Pikachu is winning. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> to me, I'm like. Dude. <laughs> I never said H box was bad. I said his fundamentals were bad. Now that's relatable. I'm done. Like, we just played a long set, whether I got washed or not, because I even get to the point. So this is so haunting. It. But it doesn't matter at this point. Big E came on stage. He was like, well, play right now. And it was in that oh, moment no. that Perfect Legend made a decision that he would never Why did he down. do that? After Why did he set him up like that? In front of the All right, Philadelphia play right Yeah, He fucking Teddy longed him. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> He was like, you know what? 
you know what? I, I, Sonic Fox, I don't think you're bad. I just think your fundamentals were bad, and I think I could beat you if we played another match. Oh, my God. You're going to go one-on-one -on -one with Aaron Black. Holy shit, dude. Dude, t Teddy Long on SmackDown was so fucking funny. It was always The Undertaker or The Viper, Randy Orton, or a tag team match. God damn. Volunteered to sit down. I count four people in that number. ring, player. And I was in another position where... Well, it was such I, a huge pop every time, too. Why wouldn't it be? You knew you were going to see something special. Don't act on this. Uh, I look like maybe a punk or something to it. So I was like, well, crap, I'll play again. I don't care. Uh, it was not cared. that big of a deal to me. But, but you can't win. Even Perfect if you play. Legend, oh, Sonic Fox no. swapping characters did very little to change anything. Throws the cow traps and does the, oh my goodness. Oh. <sighs> Why? That's Why tough. did you do this to yourself, Perfect Legend? Oh, he has the sand oh, bomb man. fatality. I forgot series, about that. Man. Why doesn't that kill you? I remember seeing this because I, I saw this character. I was like, oh, hell yeah, a cowboy. And then I saw it. This is a throw. What the fuck? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five bullets, six bullets, post point blank, in the head. Do one series, man. Oh, he's wearing a hat. He's wearing a hat. He is wearing a hat. It's a metal hat, too. He missed all the vital organs. <laughs> nose, ear, ear, nose, mouth, ear, nose. He's okay. He can survive. And just working him now. It's so Meter bad. burn. It's pretty much over, man. He's cow trapping. In case he gets to the face, he might die due to cow trap ship. <laughs> but it didn't matter. You just ship guarding him. Oh, oh my god. My god. So I may as well be the fatal. I may as well be the fatal, right? Oh, my god. <laughs> oh my Perfect god. legend. Come on, man. They're airsoft on, guns. guns. <laughs> One game, please, bro. I wish Aaron Black had paintball guns and the guy gets up looking like the Joker. He just looks stupid. And, uh, hey! He's not even, like, really hurt. He just he just got blasted with paint all over. People are chanting 13-0 oh. in the venue. Are you serious? Sonic Fox is asking for the chance. Oh. And Sonic Fox was more than happy to oblige. Yo, oh, man. man. He might lose here. And now, Sonic Fox, all the meter in the world. Does not cancel the The Homer man, Simpson make him go. <laughs> you, uh, Aaron, you have them set to whore. This time he tries to jump, it's tagged, it's over. That was supposed to be his round, dude. Oh my god, and the Brutal. Oh, Alright, there he's shooting a lot. Stop. Because because I think he hit the brain stop. there. They can stop. I mean, like it was kind of like it was kind of like a pass in the torch moment. Uh, so like at that point in time, well, at that point in time, Sonic Fox was literally almost. Unstopped. What do you do, bro? Like, like sincerely, so what do you do? I kind of felt you like have it, to fight. It was a foregone conclusion. Perfect Legend lost zero games to thirteen, and the FGC responded by memeing on the whole situation oh and even his name immediately. That's so fucked, because it's so clever. That's so fucked. Keep challenging until you win one game. <laughs> you win one fucking game against Sonic Fox. All right. I do that all the time. Oh, hell yeah. Online? Absolutely. If I'm playing some guy and I'm miserable, I'm winning one game and I'm leaving. And I'm thinking in my head, I probably would have lost again. But for now, download complete. Don't care. Don't care. Especially if I know that guy cared a lot. If it's like a normal dude, here's what I normally do. If it's like, if they're not being an asshole, I'll win one game and then I'll go back and forth a little bit. But the bigger problem is when they win like 20 and then you win one and you don't leave and then they win the next one and then they leave. That's scummy. That's fucked up. Dude. Right? Am I wrong? Like, you finally figure it out, you think, and then you play them again, and they adapt a little bit, and then they do. I don't like that. There's never really a good time to leave. I don't know what FGC etiquette is, but I know in Smash, I, like, I'll play somebody for way too long, because, like, if I do lose a lot, I'll lose, like, 12 matches, and then I win one. I'm like, all right, well, I don't want to leave yet, and then I'll win two, and I'm like, well, I do have to go. Let me try to win three, and then I'll try to win three, and then they win, and then I'm like, shit. And then either I leave, or I try to win again, but I don't want to win all the You know what I mean? I, 
I leave whenever I feel like it. I'm my own man. Fuck my opponent. See that that Zoomer mentality. I, you've never been in an arcade. I can, you, you, you are what is wrong with online play today. Okay, here's the thing. Here's the thing. We have a whole generation of people that only play through me Coney. I'm 32. <laughs> For the purposes of this hypothetical, you are 22. Let's dial it back. For the purposes of this rant, you are now 22. I'm taking you back to the past. All right. I feel like we have a whole generation of players that have never played with somebody next to them. Like, they go into matchmaking, and what they do is, like, they'll, they'll, they'll queue up and do matchmaking against people. And so, to you, to them, you're just a bot. Like, you're I'm not a, a Tekken human. player, so I do five, but if you were Akuma player, you get all four. See, I don't know Tekken. I assume Akuma's good. Akuma's good in everything. Uh, I feel like the people who are Zoomers, right, they only do matchmaking. So everybody that they fight might as well be a level 10 CPU. You know what I'm saying? Because they, 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 a lot of them probably never played a human being, which is why you get so many Samus players in Ultimate that just go ledge to ledge because they're just trying to stay safe. They don't have the social pressures of playing at a live event. Because there's real social pressures. You play Samus and go ledge to ledge over and over. Nobody's playing friendlies with you after a week. It's true. It's true. That's real. It's a real thing. You talk like you play Ultimate Online a lot. I don't. I just used to. <laughs> I used to play, you know, that in, in 4. I don't play Smash anymore. The fuck? What are you talking about? Hell, even Lupe Fiasco joined in on the fun. See, Not people Lupe Fiasco. Affinity of, of... I wish it cut back to him and he was crying about the Lupe one. <laughs> of seeing champions, like, fall and fail. Like, no matter what, they are just... They love seeing it. They like seeing the rise of a champion and the fall of a champion. And I just so Sunny have to V2 be made a career the one out of it. Yeah. On day to them. In the years that have passed since the incident, true. Sonic Fox has gone on to cement themselves as arguably the greatest multi-game competitor the FGC has ever seen. They're 13-0 in this and Lupe beat Daigo. That's true. He did. Note in a he did. Yeah. That continues to in grow a new with game. Silverware. But for Perfect Legend, the incident is far more than that. I must have been good enough then. My first tournament, this guy played friendlies with me for like four hours. My first tournament ever, I played friend doubles friendlies with Dazwa and Dark, who are two very known um, kind of old school guys from uh, from. I think Massachusetts or Maine, New England, and they played doubles friendlies and kicked me and my friend's ass for, like, literally three hours. Maine? Is that it? Yeah, they beat our ass for three hours. And I probably still wouldn't be around if they didn't beat my ass for that long. Because <laughs> they were cool. They were funny. They weren't, like, they, they weren't, I don't know how to put it. They weren't, like, uh, assholes about it. They were cool. They were just cool guys. It was very nice. It's transformed into a you need, haunting... You need that first experience with a normal person, right? You need that first experience with, like, a normal person that doesn't take it too seriously, just playing the game. Yeah, like, they beat us every time. They weren't, like, sandbagging, but, like, I think we might have won a couple games because they were dicking around, but, like, it was... We were having fun, you know? Joke that Welcome, sadly yeah. become defining. I wonder how many people don't stay because they Evo have to play some sweat for his greatest first, you know? achievements. It's tough. Instead, he's endlessly reminded of his most public failure. There's not a day that goes by that I don't hear about it. That since that day, there's not a single day, unless I turn my entire phone off and don't go on the internet and stuff, I, I will hear about it. I could be <laughs> debating a topic that has nothing to do with fighting games, video games. Oh, dude, this is hellish. This sucks. Because they're not funny. But nobody will ever let it go. Bro needs the rebrand. You're How? You can have a new name. You can't change your face. People will know. This is like TJ Henry Yoshi. Yeah, I feel bad for him too. Games in general. It's and so will tough. Bring up thirteen zero, like to dehumanize me or something. Like I can't dehumanize. Have it's I don't know. It's it's kind of ridiculous, uh. you know. But in spite of all the ill will that is regularly thrown his way, Perfect Legend remains as committed as ever to fighting games. This dude He's is still acting. competing regularly, organizing events, and streaming. He might not have added another. Is Evo he still around? This, this cabinet, movie's old. But there's I think. still time for him to remind everyone that he was a legend before he was he still around into a meme. It happens. Like you know, it is what it is. Like I, I don't think PL story is necessarily over, 
and like there's certainly there's certainly time to like rewrite the history i mean although at this point in time yes that they will be thinking about pl at the same time can someone explain the tj henry yoshi lore to me yeah there's a video about uh half yeah a presses in a mario 64 video and TJ Henry Yoshi is like the top comment, and it just says, an A press is an A press. You can't say it's only half. So you can't say it's only half an A press. And TJ Henry Yoshi, it, he, it wasn't even like he was trying to be a meme. He was just said that. And, dude, people memed the shit out of it. To the point where, like, TJ is actually a, a fan of the channel. He's popped in here a few times and commented on YouTube. And every time I see him, I have to stop myself. I'm like, damn, he's he's royalty. He's famous. <laughs> That guy, that guy's known, and he doesn't even want to be, you know? That's crazy. Just He's just that a dude, yeah. Every day, even though you got body, like, definitely cannot be a bad thing. That cannot be a bad and thing. And that poor like, guy, like, gets, anytime he tweets anything, somebody's going to be under his tweet. It's like, dude. Been that. There are people who are living through me in that moment, and I get that. They're invested. I understand. You know, I appreciate them for caring about the scene and, and just the, the sport of what we're doing. Because that in itself is beautiful. So like, that's true. That's dope. Even Outside the haters are fans. Something that's true. Amazing, I think. Is that it? I think the pause is. Okay, bloopers. Okay. Why are we explaining ancient YouTube lore? Because people were asking. Yahoo! Yahoo! People were curious. Hit it. I wish I could take over other people's streams when I raided. I wish when I raided, I could play. Go raid Alfred. It's his birthday. It was yesterday. Go say happy birthday. <laughs>